Hello! And I'm frozen. Boop, boop. And I'm not anymore. Hello, everybody. How y'all doing? How's it been going? AJ died. AJ's dead. Hello, Megan. Hello, the random. Hello, Dante. Hello, Zeth. Cater. Juna. Hello, everybody. Hi. But, but a very special of hellos to Anchor. Dark type gaming. And the geek chick for being <laughs> members on YouTube. Why do you stress it like that? Because <laughs> she used to be the geek chic. And I thought it was still, was it pronounced like that? Yes, and everybody oh, okay. pronounced it wrong. So oh, she, just, okay. she just went with it. Uh, so, all right, gotcha. That's why. That's why. So it's one I, of those. I mean, I, I wasn't. I, I don't even think it's a gift gif situation. When it was the other thing, I I was there when it was spelled like that, but I I just heard people. Yeah, no, every <laughs> like everybody just said it wrong. It was spelled chic. It was supposed to be chic, but everybody spelled it. Everybody just said it wrong. So she just rolled with chick. Now there's gonna be Mandela effect. But backwards. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the Elite Four. This is not called that. It's not called that. And it's not even that in function. But who cares? I'm doing Marnie first. I don't I don't remember, dude. I, well, according to Sarabee.net that I don't totally don't have on screen right now. Uh, <laughs> yes. She's got all dark and shit. All right. Uh, Lord Sal says, love you, no homo. <laughs> Why not? Why not, Why not just homo? Why not? Dude? I don't get it. It's 2020, man. It's true. It's true. I want We're almost fairy. half a month in the 2020, dude. Why not? Why yeah. not? I want fighting. I got some fighting moves on this bitch, right? Wait, why did, why did this get... Uh, oh, because he said shitty. Uh, Donovan Ellis says, using a custom Lego Technic stand that makes for a much better viewing angle than that shitty kickstand Nintendo gave us. A what now? A Lego, a custom lo Lego Technic stand. Oh, so we like made a stand at a, at a Lego Technics. That's cool. Shepherd Boy says, never got a warning, stupid YouTube. Stupid and YouTube. Lord Sal said, fine, full homo. <laughs> Make sure you're checking your, your app settings that you have notifications allowed on the app level. George's video show says, love you, very homo. <laughs> <laughs> very homo. <laughs> All right. I think I'm ready to, to get on in here. I went, uh, I wanted to buy more. Oh, so you can pay to win? Yeah, I uh, want to pay to win, baby. Right. Can I go back to the lobby? Buy some stuff? Oh, I can. Cool. All right, where's the, where's the merchant? Oh, I'm just leaving. Okay, I'm just gonna leave, I guess. I upped, I upped my bit rate a little bit. Uh-huh. Is that why you asked MDB what bitrate he streams at? Yeah, I went from, uh, I used to stream at 6,000 kilobits. Now I'm at 8. Trying it out. Feeling it out. You know? See what God. happens. The thing is that I stream and record, uh, do a local recording at the same time. So, mm -hmm. it's really 16,000 that my computer's doing. I don't know where the Fonja loop I'm going. I bet you MDB streams are like a billion kilobits. Yeah, probably. He's a crazy person. That's that's true. He his Discord runs at like a billion kilobits. Oh, there's an item. Give me max revive. I'll take it. Yeah, I remember him talking about that. <laughs> Where? 
is the stupid uh oh i can just do it in the pokemon center i'm so stupid i'm looking for a pokemart i forgot this game's new and different The Peppy Ace says, hey, what's your fave Pokemon game, Sword or Shield? <laughs> uh, I have not played Shield, so I guess it's Sword. Shield trash, man. It's garbage. Worst game. Oh, my God. I do not want that many. Jeez. Only thing good about Shield is that you get Gigantamax Lapras. That's it. <laughs> you can't do that in Sword? You can, but somebody in Shield has to find it. Oh. Um. Because it's exclusive. And we got freaking Colossal, which is dumb. Gigantamax Colossal is stupid. Don't want. Oh, there's no uh, max revives. Rosa Sabe says, hey, I like shield. Well, I'm sorry to tell you, you you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, to, sorry to hit you with this with this news. Are, are you in the right mindset to handle this news? <laughs> you are wrong. <laughs> I'm going to use that. Are you sitting down right now? I have something to tell you. <laughs> You're wrong. <laughs> um, Jason, or son, says, Hey, Wolf, one F. Wolf. Wolf. Hey. Wolf. Wolf. Uh, you look like Jesus Christ. <laughs> Bless you. Bless you, my child. I'm gonna have to crack a window open in here. Uh, Clash with Lou says, I can give you shiny G Max Lapras if you can beat the Elite Four. No items and no fainting. There is no Elite Four. That's a that's a loophole. He's trying to get you. Don't do it. <laughs> if I faint, I will be shocked. I have not fainted so far in this game. You mean if you white out? That's different. Because you've 100% fainted. Oh, you mean the Pokemon faint? Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I... A whiteout? They call it a whiteout? Yeah. Because he says you I, blacked I out. Where? Did, where? It says that in this game now? Oh, what, does this game say whiteout? I don't know. I've never had it happen to me. All Pokemon games say that's whiteout. Guys about. But I don't, I, don't, I don't even know if that's no, true. No, they say you blacked out. No. But 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 the game whites out like it it turns white. All I know is in the the old games like freaking Pokemon Yellow, which I think was the last time I've done that. <laughs> it says white it out. I thought it says you black out. No. Uh -huh. Koji Coco says hi, Dad. Hi. Speedy Gonzalez with two pounds. Says, did you see Inteleon starring in Pokemon Gun? I sure did. And I'm fighting Marnie. Shit's getting real. What is this stupid Pokemon? This is, oh, it's just dark. So get, get absolutely wrecked right now. Uh, get wrecked. Zeth Cater says, if I ditto bread, it spelled like the, the food item. Uh, a shiny. Do I get more shiny of the same Pokemon? No. Um, you get an increased odds of getting a shiny if you breed two Pokemon that are from two different regions. Also, if you have uh, freaking uh, what's it called? The shiny charm. Let's go against fighting here. We got flying. Psychic and Fairy. I don't want to keep you. I'm going to use this Pokemon the whole time. Oh, but it's also Poison. Oh, Psychic, dude. Keep, keep going, baby. We're going to Psychic the shit out of this bitch.
get halved. Me. Uh, Scrafty. Don't like. Don't like that name. Um. What? Why? Why? <laughs> can't fight. It's the dumb name. <laughs> Oh, it's Orton Show because half the people are attacking the game and the other half are defending it. Boo, boo, leaf. Oh, I just want to use fairy gun. Just fighting it. Yep. The Peppy Ace says, Can you explain why Sword is a better game? Haven't played it. Because it's a sword! Shields are stupid! Swords are cool! <laughs> it's just about the Pokemon you put in the, that are in the game. Mo- they're mostly exactly the same, so don't even worry about it. Also, <laughs> most of them you can just trade for. The only, the only one that, like, you're probably not gonna- Like, nobody's gonna just, like, fucking give you the legendary. <laughs> like, that's probably the only one that you couldn't trade for. Oh. Uh, you know. The sword went in school with. Because he has a sword. And swords are cool with shield. I might switch to Steelix for this one, just because- Wait, Steelix even ground? Um, he's steel and ground. Or steel yeah. and rock, one of those. But I think it's ground. Uh, Jinkoff says, I'm telling you, Bob Wolf is a, is a, as vegan as he is jacked. What? The, what? <laughs> I saw him at the Penn Station Starbucks the other day, and he was buying Nitro Cold Brew, trademark, uh, and, uh, and an apricot granola bar with four Gs of fiber. I asked uh, him why so much fiber, and he said it helps expel all this bullshit I hear these kids talk. Then he spilled all his drink and couldn't post it on Instagram. You know what? That sounds like something that happened. I hate that so much. <laughs> <laughs> he was doing that. Who he's, He did that to me, and then I, who did I raid the other day? Oh, I think it was Dan. Wait, he said that he told Dan about your veganism? No, then you just continue that bullshit. Like, uh, another one of those, like, copy pastas. Oh. So, let me tell you this nonsense. Uh, uh so I was, I was with my brother yesterday. He was like, yo, I want to get some food. You want to get some food? I was like, all right, let's get some food. He's like, yo, I want to get vegan burgers. I was like, no! <laughs> I was like, no! Ugh! I refuse! <laughs> I can't perpetuate this lifestyle. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, how did this happen? How did the where did this come from? So he's been watching Wolf Den secretly, I'm sure of it. <laughs> <laughs> so you did not get that. Hell no. Hell no. I paid extra money to not get that. <laughs> Cause his friend, like, she sells him real heavy. So he was like trying to get over her and I was like, nah. Man. Let's just like get some pizza and some shit. I ate a vegan, a vegan burger at Full Sail once and I was upset because I didn't know they were vegan burgers. I just know that they were like, hey, we got f uh, free food today. And they were like, we got burgers and fucking like other shit, like hot dogs and all that shit. And I bit into it, it was like beans. And I was like, no, <laughs> this is no okay. This guy Grim Snarl. Is a dark and fairy. So the fairy cancels out. Uh, we got new members: Joshua Ray and uh, Clash with Lou. Joshua Ray and Clash with Lou. Nice to be a members here. I appreciate you and love you very much. Maybe I do want to do fairy. Yeah, maybe I'll just do fairy. Uh. West Sider 112 says, Why is this game so easy? This is supposed to be a champion cup. What the hell? Because it's a Pokemon game. Made for children. If he's dark and fairy and I hit him with a fairy move, am it'll I good? do neutral damage. It'll take neutral damage? Yes. If you it won't do, do like more, a little more than neutral? No. If you want to do more than neutral, you got to hit him with like a fucking steel type attack. Or not, I don't hit him with poison to be safe because I don't know. I don't know how if I have poison. dark and steel or whatever. Because I have no poison, but I do like, have steel. 
neutral damage against steel or something like that, but I don't know what it is reverse. Um, no, steel is effective against dark, I think. Okay, so if steel, steel is neutral oh, steel damage. Is, steel is neutral damage. Yeah, against dark. Yeah, so it double does, against it does two, Yeah, it does double. So you steal or poison. Okay, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna stick with Steelix then. And I guess I'll Dynamax. I was gonna try to not Dynamax. Eric said, get out of here with your healthy ass eating habits. Tsukuyomi says, Bob looking up spoilers while he's playing the game. Like you've never done that. Yo, Grimmsnarl looks badass when he's diamonded. When I was looking up uh, thumbnails for this, I was like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> he looks like a, like a, a freaking gargoyle. Like from the TV show. From the TV show Gargoyle, the hit show Gargoyle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That Will just recently watched. Are you can ask him about it on Wolf Hill. <laughs> you know what? You're saying he only recently watched it? Like rewatched it. Oh, I was about to say, because uh, that seems like a show that Will would like. The video game for the Genesis is pretty good. You said it was for the Genesis. So. It's um, good and it's uh, very hard to emulate. It's a hard M game to emulate for some reason. It's a hard M? <laughs> it's a hard M. Um, but... Ah, I oh, could one hit him. Did you see the Sonic Incredibles thing? With the two Sonics talking to each other? Yeah. That was from The Incredibles? Yes. I didn't know that. Did you I not? I was like, these voice actors are really good. <laughs> It was freaking, um... I've never seen The Incredibles. Wow. I'm surprised by that, too. I'm surprised it's freaking Will didn't drag you there or something. He yes. likes The Incredibles. He I know he does. That's what I'm saying. Like the best movie. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. You surprised. used a potion? You're not allowed. Only I'm allowed. Yeah. I'm asleep. Shit, I might die. I'm going to use a potion to wake him up. Because two played this game. All right, Jax Nas, I read that. You put that in there before. If you put it in there again, you're getting timed out. Fair warning. Get a punch in the damn mouth. Also true. Oh, he's snoozing me again. How come the snooze hurts? I don't like that. What? Oh, good, he's not gigantic max anymore. He does max snooze, and I take damage. Oh. Uh... But I'm not asleep. Oh, I'm still good. All right. Well, it is what I did and just ripped the audio. Yeah. Who said they ripped the audio? Do I have a move that will definitely attack first? No. All right. We'll just keep doing this. But anyway, the scene was like from The Incredibles when, uh, the you know, Mr. Incredible and his wife, they were fighting because uh, the, the Mr. Incredible wanted to be a superhero again. He was like doing su it, superhero shit. It secret. sounded like two Sonics talking. It was, but they were reenacting the scene uh... from The Incredibles. That's why freaking Sonic called Sonic Bob, <laughs> because that's right. Mr. Incredible's name. I did not know that. They did a really good job though. Take that, Marnie. Turns out you actually suck. That's why I retweeted it, and I was like, I'm convinced that Will commissioned this because that is just like, uh, a fuck like that. That either he commissioned it or it was like a Facebook algorithm thing. I thought you him. said that because they were saying Bob, and it was Sonic. no, no. It's because it was two Sonics, uh, reenacting freaking The Incredibles. If it was just it be if they said Bob, I would have tweeted at you. But no, mm -hmm. that's not enough. That's not Facebook level of targeting. <laughs> All right, now I'm fighting Hop.
Uh. Oh, I'm all revived already. Yet. Well, that seems uh. Seems a little uh a little too easy here. Uh, he's got all different types of freaking Pokemon. I'll just go with uh my Bubsy. Sukuyomi said, um, I'm trying to kill myself in Pokemon Red to find out if it says white out or not, but this dugong refuses to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen it say blackout, but I don't know. Maybe I thought it said it, like you blacked out. It says in at least the games that it happened to me, I know it says white out. I've never seen it say blacked out, blacked out. And I was, I always, and I remember that because I always thought like, why, why is it not black out? I was like, is that Would like a center thing? You or is white it like out? a translation? Yeah, it was like your trainer whited out. That's what it says. That doesn't <laughs> sound right. It doesn't. And that's why I remember it. Thank you for being a member here on YouTube. I'm playing Pokemon Let's Go and I'm having a blast. Oh my god, goodbye. I said I was going to time out. I changed my mind. You're just getting straight up blocked. <laughs> <laughs> um, I just Google imaged it. Uh, it seems that in some cases it says blackout and in some cases it says whiteout. Yeah, that's what I mean, apparently, but I ne I yeah. never seen it say blackout. What games does it say blackout? The player will black out in, uh, uh, when all the Pokemon on the player's team faint. This is comparable to game over screens for the Pokemon games. It generally occurs in battle, but it can also occur in the overworld. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Serb says, how drunk are you, AJ? What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> in English releases of Generation 2 and 3 games, and Japanese releases of Generation 2 and Heart, Gold, and Soul, Silver, the player will instead white out. So in Gen 2 and 3, it's white out, and everything else is blackout. Gotcha. Um, in the English version of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Sword and Shield, the player will instead be overwhelmed by their defeat. <laughs> <laughs> so it's different in that, too. So it's oh, different in every game. I definitely didn't know that. That's how you know that that didn't happen to me in this game. Uh, there you go. Now, poor Hop's going to be annihilated in front of his friends and family. Coriander XR says, not drunk enough. I have not been drunk in like seven years. I had a beer and a, an old fashioned the other day, and I had a hangover the next day, and I didn't even, I wasn't even drunk. <laughs> like, why do I even do that? Myself? Oh, that was, see, that was another thing um, that happened when I was with my brother, because he's your age. So he was like, he was like, um, he was like, you know what, AJ? I'm, I'm admitting to you that I am old. <laughs> like you, you stayed all the time, but now I am coming to the realization that I am indeed old. <laughs> what, 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 what put him over the edge? Uh, you know, just general being old shit, like his knees hurting all the time and like that type of stuff. And also, he calls people young punks, which is like oh he's God. he's like eighty four, just for <laughs> saying that. <laughs> like, I don't have any aches. <laughs> I'm good in that department. Snorlax. Oh, he's normal, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm keeping this guy. Keep current Pokemon. Thirteen Zay says, "What's an old fashioned? It's a drink." With that bourbon. is when you still have your pants on and they rub over the top. No, <laughs> it's um, it's a whiskey drink that is basically just whiskey, a little bit of sugar, and um like an orange peel and some bitters I still don't even know what bitters are you know what this is the, the place to google it 
Let's look at, uh, let me pin this tab, because I almost Googled it on the freaking Hangout tab. <laughs> the explanations are never, uh, I need to, like, actually just eat, like, just pour just bitters into my mouth. <laughs> Oh, this is like a whole freaking thing, dude. But stop at the full restore, man. God. I know, bitter, like explaining bitters is. I'm just, I have some. I'll just go into the other room and pour it into my mouth and let y'all know what happens. <laughs> is that what they put on the Switch cartridges? Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna need some, uh,. Oh, good. That'll do a lot of damage. Good. He's dead. That dude says the sugar is why you were hungover. It's not. If a that's lot the of case, sugar. you are definitely old. You are. It's 1, not. It's not. The sh there's at most one sugar cube, and that's it. It's because the way I eat while I consume alcohol, like if I don't eat enough during the day or throughout the day, it'll fuck me up. But it's always been like that. It's not an old thing. This guy's an electric type? Electric type? <laughs> electric good against steel? It's neutral. That's so dumb. No, you're dumb. It should be ineffective. Ah, whatever. That doesn't even make sense. It's fucking conductive. Exactly. Or if it's okay, then it should be super effective, like it is to water. Nah, man, that's not balanced. <laughs> I think the rationale there is that a lot of steel types are like robots of some sort, or like they're mechanical. Uh huh. Uh huh. So it doesn't need to You get earthquake. But you have to get like a fucking TM and it's somewhere in the wild area. I have so many of those. It's from yeah. doing like max raid battles and stuff. Yeah, I don't do those. Oh uh, yeah, true. Now that I do now that I'm beating this, if I beat this within the next two and a half hours, maybe we can do some. Hey, even though we both got shield, so it's useless. <laughs> I mean sword, not shield. <laughs> now I freaking fuck well then again. Not useless for you to be able to find Earthquake, because I think you can get uh, Earthquake from beating Gigantamax uh, fucking Colossal. <laughs> MDB said some shit. What did he say? Dox, dox him. <laughs> uh, I use I used TweetDeck, and it takes a while to update. Oh, he said a lot of shit, dude. A lot. Were like three messages, man. <laughs> do this. Oh, he streams at what I streamed at, uh, six megabits. I'll answer him later. How oh, come on? He's got like ah. Uh, he's got like uh, like a little, like, eh. That's you true. know? <laughs> Super Yomi says, electric is good against water because if you shock a fish, it's dead. But if you shock a steel, shock a steel slab, it's fine. Remember when my reasoning for not thinking that electric was good against water was like that water is that, really conductive like, like, if it's distilled. It's yeah, the distilled water. water. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> It's like, that's, that's stupid. That's even more dumb. <laughs> the same thing with electric and flying. Electricity hits planes all the time, and they're just cool with it. Because they're not grounded. Right. But also, birds get shocked from being on the stupid things. <laughs> on the freaking telephone poles and shit. Right, right, right. Oh, we got a corp night. What do I want to do here? Yep. Could do fire, right? Fire against who? 
Corp Knight? Yes. You could also do electric, as we just learned. Because electric is neutral damage. See, it's basically, if something's neutral, that's a zero. If something's super effective, that's a two. If you something's know what? resisted, I'm, that's I'm doing, a, I'm doing electric two because another direction. my Bubsy's almost dead. Uh, Sean says, Bob, your little Pokemon trainer needs a little haircut, man. Your little face needs to shut the fuck up, my guy. Uh, Sukiyomi brings up a good point and says, planes are steel type, though. True. And fly, they're steel and flying, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Bob, do you have a video on the retro tank? Do you actually, no, I have one on the OSSC. I do have a retro tank, I just never made a video on it. <laughs> Coriander XR says, guys, I raise birds for a living, and trust me, if any amount of electricity hits them, they are dead. <laughs> <laughs> beep, beep, beep. What happens when more Peko turns into the big scary more Peko? He gets angry, and he turns into a dark type, I think. <laughs> Uh, now he's gonna be Rylaplume, right? He picks the the worst Pokemon than you, right? Who uh, Hop? Yeah. Yes. What the fuck did you just call him? <laughs> Ry Rylaplume. It's gorilla, like gorilla. All right. Well, he picks that one, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I gotta put a fucking potion. Uh, Jinkoff says, whoa, 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 Bob, you can't say that. You don't know his gender. You just called him a his. Can't who, answer. who? I don't know, but <laughs> I just know Jinkoff said something about not knowing the, the whatever Pokemon or person's gender and then proceeded to call them a his. So you can't freaking get mad at him for doing what you just did. I'm going to hit Dynamax. Oh, I can't Dynamax and use a potion? Well, that sucks. Daniel C says, Steelix looks like my dad. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, I remember I told this kid, um, well, I, I too was a kid because this was in school, but I told this kid that his head looked like Magnemite and he got upset and told the <laughs> teacher and I got sent to the principal. I was mad. What? Shepherd Boy says, I wish I had an AJ helping me play Pokemon. You can if you go to youtube.com slash Fnax4, go to the Pokemon playlist. There's a ton, ton, ton of me fucking helping people play Pokemon. And he also uh, does freelance work. You can hire him to just be there while you play. <laughs> yeah, just freaking sit there and be like, use freaking Thunderbolt. <laughs> I might do freight I might lose Bubsy. Oh. <laughs> Good. Jinkoff says, oh no, 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 don't cancel me. Jamie89 says, is this Pokemon Snap? <laughs> yes. 2020? It didn't he even gained, come out in 2020, canceled. He gained a little HP. Dynamax. Oh, goodbye. Did you use a grass type attack? Did you use freaking, uh, or did he use, uh, freaking Dynamax overgrowth or whatever? I don't know. Max overgrowth. I don't know. If he did that, that's why. All right, I didn't lose Bobsy. Everything's good. I'm not qualified to read that one. Thanks, um, mate. Oh. I'm really glad you were the one here with me to 
Whoop my ass. Thanks for your money, Hop. I'll, I take Venmo. All right. Is this, is he going to be all sad? You know, even when Sonya was saying that you and me looked like we could become heroes, I really never felt like one. But you, mate, I think maybe you really could do all sorts of great things. Good on you, Bob. And Cinderus, you mean Bubsy, and all the rest of your team. Yo, what? you know what I didn't remember? What? That Ash's mom, you know how Ash's mom has Mr. Mime? Uh, yeah. That's his Mr. Mime. I didn't remember that shit. But I do remember the episode where he got it. But I didn't remember that that was his for whatever reason. So does, does he just not care? He just left it at the house? I mean, now I think he has it. Like, now I think it's currently in his party. In the, like, in the anime right now, in Japan. He has it in his party. And that's why I was like, what? And I freaking went to Bulbapedia. And I was like, oh yeah, I remember that episode. <laughs> Gucci Pop Tart says, Hi, I'm new to the stream. <laughs> All right. All right, so now I got to fight BD. It's Bead. We established this. <laughs> Bead? Yes. BD? BD. Oh, we got to like do a whole thing first? That's like half of a Star Wars droid name. <laughs> You and Challenger Hop were both endorsed by the champion, making the two of you rivals in a sense, wouldn't you say? How does it feel to have defeated your rival? Uh, it doesn't fucking matter. Mr. Mime is Ash's stepdad. Question number two. If you wanted to tell Challenger Hop something right now, what would it be? I love you, and then give him a kiss on the mouth. <laughs> that he was just the rival I knew he was. A shitty one. True. Question three. Level with me, kiddo. Your honest thoughts here. Think you can win the finals too? Yeah. I absolutely do. All right, that's enough. Bob's already tired for battle. I like Hop now. Hop's great. <laughs> and you've been asking rather rude questions. You've got our, we've got ourselves dinner plans with my brother. So sorry, but clear off already, would you? Piss off. Hop's great now. I like Hop again. I never... I think there was like 10% of the game where I didn't like Hop. But the second that I met Leon, I was like, nah, fuck him. You know? Well, you can hate Hop. both. No, 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 no. Because Hop was only insufferable because of his brother. No, he's insufferable because he just kept talking. And you knew that he was saying bullshit that didn't matter because he sucks. <laughs> nah, I don't really care about that because I know the game's going to do that anyway. Um, I just didn't like him because he was he was like acting like he was competent and he's not, and he will never be. <laughs> all right, can I skip this shit? I thought we were just gonna. I just thought we were just gonna plow through all this. Shepard Boy says, I want Pokemon to make another Let's Go, and instead of it being a remake of Yellow, it's a Red and Blue remix. That would make people so angry. They're doing a Let's Go this year. It's called Mystery Dungeon. <laughs> <laughs> and it's not very good. I like Mystery Dungeon, but it's for the same reason why I like this game. Where it's like, I, like as a game, don't like it that much. But because it's Pokemon, I'm like, yeah, I'm down. I want to be a Pokemon. I bet you Mystery Dungeon is great on the Game Boy Advance. And that's it. It's also on the DS. <laughs> yeah. I don't know about that. Where am I supposed to go? Dinner plans? You go to, to dinner, man. <laughs> Yo, I forgot that game existed. Shepard Boy said, like, Jedi Fallen Order. I don't know in response to what, but I forgot that game existed, and I should probably play it, but, like, at the same time, probably not going to. Who's Miss Olina? That's the, the, the lady that's with Rose. 
This is the first I'm seeing this person. That's not even true. Never seen this person before in my life. I'm sorry, this game's like 80 hours long. I forgot what <laughs> happened at the beginning. <laughs> what? Wait, what, the f what is he talking about? Oh. I don't really understand what's going on because I was plowing through this, but I probably should have been paying attention. <laughs> Jeremiah said she's hot. <laughs> she's a cartoon. That's true. Let's find Alina's league staff member. That bad one was wearing those lame shades, right? They're all wearing sunglasses. I think they were silver, though. God, they all look the same. I think he had gray hair, though. Alexis says, you gotta play hide and seek with the sunglasses, dude. That's annoying. It is annoying. This whole segment is annoying. And yeah. it's like... Frick it, like, it's the shit that everybody's like, Pokemon Sword and Shield didn't have enough of this bullshit, where it's like, hey, uh, let's interrupt the League Challenge to, like, chase this guy. Yeah, I just want to frickin' fucking... do the damn League Challenge. I want to get this <laughs> shit over with. Oh, he's facing the wall here. <laughs> How could it not be this guy? <laughs> hey, Bob, this bloke's awfully shifty, but I can't get him to turn around. Say something surprising so that he'll have no choice but to look this way. Say, Hop's a good trainer! <laughs> Uh, we already have the key, you know. What? Blast to turn around, and I can't escape. In that case, time for a Pokemon battle. All right. Slugnut says, does anyone else think that Bob has a beautiful voice? Bag van. <laughs> I think if you make the type of videos that we do, and it's they're at all sustainable. Um, you got a couple of compliments on your voice, because otherwise, people will watch. They're like, "This dude's voice is annoying." Click off. One of the guys at YouTube asked if I took voice training. Oh my god! And I said no. It's been six years or so of doing this shit. And this is just my voice all the time. I forgot to see what he's pulling out. No, you know what? You were freaking, um, in, in your last video. What was the last video? It was a fucking macro controller situation. Um, and they're like the, the parts when you like cut in and were like, oh, no, I tried this and this one's better, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. You were like talking like you talk now <laughs> versus like how you're talking in bit, like how you're like freaking. Uh, not yelling, but like projecting. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're just like, you know, like just. Oh, like, yeah. yeah that was like four in the morning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, as, so I was trying not to be too loud. When I when I cut in and I was like at my desk. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because yeah, uh, yeah, that was uh, that was at like four in the morning. Because that's when I realized all that other shit that I could do with that controller. Where are you going now? Do I gotta uh, do I gotta find you again? God. Yes, you do. Damn it! <laughs> Change your sunglasses. Yeah, at least. This is this is that dumb shit that people are like. Oh, cool. Sword Shield doesn't have more than this. Game Freak. Uh, is on this one. How'd you find me? Because it's you fucking not hot. You're not doing it. You're not even trying. <laughs> I use my frickin' Chromecast. Why not, Shepherd Boy? What's wrong with you? 
your Chromecast to do what? Watch this. Uh, Jeremiah says, do you hate when you kill Pokemon and you have to hide the body in a Pokeball? Omari says, walk your profanity. <laughs> Fuck that. You know? <laughs> what am I gonna eat? I don't know, man. I get that same question. I ordered food before. I guess I gotta do it again. I should probably, like, do that, like, now. Because everything closes. I might just get pizza. I already had pizza yesterday. I don't open it again. They say hide a, hide a tree in a forest, so I thought I could hide myself in the crowd. Well, you did a terrible job. Don't. God! Sukuyomi says, just eat some toast. No. Uh, is this him in the friggin' phone booth? I can I can tell it's you because you're you're doing weird shit. Thirteen says, "Stop eating on stream. It gets me so hungry." I Is don't it? ever eat on stream. Yeah, nobody do. But I do have coffee cake, uh, Drake's cakes. That I might eat on stream. <laughs> Sorry about it. What's open? I need to go to the end. Got all of his Pokemon are like weak to fire. Yeah, man. That's a poorly balanced team. Better be it. This is six Pokemon now. See all. Beedy beedy beedy. Macaroni grill. Seems like you've got me cornered, but I'm not going to give up. An earful from Miss Olina is way worse than anything a lot of you could do. Good luck catching me on the monorail. He's like a grown ass man. You should be able to catch up to him. They got freaking Cracker Barrel on DoorDash. <gasps> <laughs> oh, you don't like pancakes. It's closed anyway. Everything on their menu is in all caps. <laughs> Because they're yelling at you. Crispy artichokes! <laughs> <laughs> you did a cracking job of cornering that bad league staff member, Bob. Let me swing you a song fitting of your rockin' deeds. The only thing a humble singer can do is sing a humble song. Oh, this part's weird. Maybe I can't cheer someone on just with the tunes I play. Oh, he's singing. I'm not doing it. There's freaking five guys. I can get five guys. I should get five guys. Oh, that's a good idea. Hey, isn't that Piers? Why is he doing a street performance? Oh, God. How cinematic. Let's go Everett. <laughs> what? Am I? Is there going to be more bullshit? <laughs> or is the finals just the finals? Oh, God, there's a lot of finals. Uh, Psychodelirious says, Bob, any chance we could see you do some kind of challenge run in any Pokemon game, whether it be a Nuzlocke or having a mono team, etc.? 
very low chance of that. And if it ever does happen, it would be on Twitch. Bob barely gets through the game. Just yeah, you can't fucking put all that shit on him. You know? Yeah. Uh, Thirteen says went to a burger place today called Shake Shack. It was good. <gasps> Go again. Get the chicken sandwich. It is good. I'm going to have to crack a window up in this bitch. I'm surprised by that. Well, never mind. I was about to say I'm surprised that Five Guys doesn't have a minimum on here. Mm-hmm. But I'm not because, like, you order anything from Five Guys, you're going to. Yeah, it's expensive. <laughs> yeah, you're paying like $15 anyway. I don't know if you knew this already, but I've heard Rose Rose Tower was built on a power spot. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I don't. When we get up to the roof and have a bit of space, we can Dynamax our Pokemon. Ooh, am I going to beat up Chairman Rose before I even do the finals? Oh my god. You'll be leaving right now, so there's no need to worry about the lift. Oh god. Who would do that? <laughs> it says unlimited toppings. Choose a maximum of twenty-two. Yeah, no. I I could feel that. Everybody would do give me one of everything. <laughs> what why would you do that? Given the option. Dude, people fucking order a uh, hundred patties on a burger at McDonald's. That's ridiculous. I, I should have gone to the Pokemon Do you Center even have this. any two options on here? One, two, three. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, uh, yeah, they have, they have more than 22 options on here. What do we got here? Boom Burst. The user attacks everything around it with the destructive power of a terrible explosive sound. Is there anything... I should know about Boom Burst. It's a good move. All right. That, I will get rid of all four. Yeah, that move garbage. Also, it's kind of just like the better version of it. <laughs> Sounds like a heart attack waiting to happen. <laughs> Having to give up my pocket money, losing means I'm back in the red. Yeah, dude, get out of here. I like how you beat them in a Pokemon battle, and they're just like, "Err, fine, you can, you, you can, can trespass pass. now." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rose and Sabe say, "Ooh, yes, one with everything, please, because it's for the gram." <laughs> yeah, no, people would do that. That's true. I mean, that is a YouTube video title. My friends are just talking about going on this like fucking tibetan place and getting like the max spiciness that they have and it's like a challenge you know and they were talking about how it just like you know they couldn't like walk for three days <laughs> it's like why the fuck would you ever want that to happen that's true i already got two dead very sad what are you talking about in a nuzlocke <laughs> Oh, I started a, a Nuzlocke in shield. Oh, gotcha. Oh, I'm fighting with Hop. Oh my god, we're such friends. Best buddies. I stopped drinking uh, Poland Spring bottles. Because I'm uh, vegan now. Oh, uh, yeah, true. No, mm -hmm. it's because uh, I just plow through them too much. <laughs> so I got a Brita filter. The downside is, now I'm out of water. And I got to go all the way to the other room and get more. Rip. <laughs> Jeremiah said, imagine if someone's in jail and they beat the security guards. Okay, fine, you're out of jail. Ow. 
Yeah, that's what it's like. It's like, hey, you can't do that crime. Ah, rat! You beat me in a game of cards. Bob Hop sounds like a music genre. How come I'm like not doing a lot of damage here? There we go. That's what I wanted. <laughs> Rosa Sabe said, spicy food releases some good adrenaline, but I'm not into that type of life. Yeah, it's the thing. People are like, uh, it, gets the, it makes them like, it gives them like a high. But then you're like all fucked up. <laughs> And it's not like you're, t you're doing a drug. I'm fine with spicy food until it gets to the point where you got like, like physical, like, like side effects as you're eating it. Like fucking like sweat and like yeah. your freaking face starts hurting and stuff like that. Like once it gets up into like 3 million Skullville units place, I'm like, ah, it's not worth it. I'm not good with spicy food, but yesterday I had some spicy food and it was good. And it was it was all right. I was able to do it. And it was good. I just usually don't like what it tastes like. Like yeah, yeah, I, I, can, want I can I can eat jalapenos and I'm not like freaking out, you know, but I just don't like the taste of them. I need flavor. <laughs> yeah. I need there to be a flavor that makes it worth it. True. <laughs> I was touching the controller while it's on the desk. And my mic's attached to the desk. Uh, Psychodelirious says, Sorry, I'm sure you guys have already been asked, but any thoughts on the upcoming Pokemon DLC? I'm excited for it. I think that hate for it is overblown. Uh, I think it's going to be really cool. I'm glad I they're think... doing this instead of another game, because I wouldn't have wanted to play another game. Um, I agree. Except, I mean, I would have played it. Um, but I'm glad that they're doing it. I think that everybody wanted them to do it, except for the people that just want to be mad. Um, yeah, I think people just want to be them mad. Too. Like, they, everybody was like, they, you know what they should do? Before the games came out, before Sword and Shield came out, you know what they should do? Do DLC instead of the second versions of the game. And they're like, all right, cool, we'll do that. <laughs> and everybody's like, I remember the good, I freaking saw this dumbass meme. And it was like the, the good Game Freak, like before Game Freak turned in the EA, and it had every Pokemon game. And then it was, like, and then it was like now Game Freak, and then they replaced the E and the A with EA's logo, and it just had Sword and Shield. And I'm like, but you have like freaking Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon in the good Game Freak segment, where literally you're just buying the same game over again and some extra story. So it's like you're paying forty dollars or potentially eighty dollars if you're using everybody's dumbass logic. Um, I thought to, that was the same sarcasm. Game that meme, because I saw it, that and it just didn't make any fucking sense like, at all. So dumb. People are dumb. I can't stand. I can't stand it. <laughs> um, I they're gonna sell less. They're gonna make less money by making it DLC, but it's just better for. I don't know. If, I don't know if they will though. That's the thing. I think they will um, because you need to have Sword or Shield first, right? And they always, if it's a physical game, there's no barrier to entry. You know, you just get the game. And, and right, you know, a but, fucking mom goes into the store and goes, "Oh, that's Pokemon. I want it." Yeah, but the thing with this is. There are a lot of people like you that like they buy the first version of the game and then they're just like, oh, well, I, don't, I already have that other version. Like, why, why would I buy it again? Uh, whereas now there's incentive to buy into it because it's like, well, I already have this game. I'm getting advertised this DLC, this $30 thing or whatever. And then more people just like compulsory, like they buy it. I just think the attach end. rate for DLC in general is very low. Yeah, but I think the I think see, the thing is, I think the Pokemon games, like the third entry, were already effectively DLC. So they have the same effect that a lot of DLC does, but right. now you get the benefit of like it being cheaper and it like being in your face mm -hmm. anyway. So like people were already like repulsed by the, the 
DLC games effectively because like you're playing through the same game over again but now it's additional content you're not starting the story over so you're not replaying any content you're just getting all the additional stuff that that's what is most intriguing to me is that I can c continue my game I can right all the stuff that I've already done will affect this game like I can bring all my Pokemon into that game which is I I would probably not play it if it was a different game yeah. I'd be like, I don't want to play the same shit again. I'm not doing that. I always enjoy the Pokemon players that don't have... Yeah. And people that don't have the DLC can also participate in raid battles. From the DLC. <laughs> I don't know if they can participate in the, the new raids or whatever, where they're like actual raids, you know, like where you go under the, the den. This whole section is very annoying. I just want to. Yes, it is. <laughs> I just want to do the freaking challenge, man. What are we learning now? Oh, finally, a new freaking electric move. Where Peko attacks and raises its speed with the energy stored in its cheeks. The moves type changes depending on the user's form. Yeah, dude. Not only DLC, but I heard Pokemon Home is coming, meaning transfer Pokemon to Sword and Shield. Yep. And that was the other thing that people were like, oh, so they're walling off the Pokemon and you got to pay $30. I was like, no. <laughs> like, if anything, the, the existence of the DLC, whether you buy it or not, is good for the people that played the previous games and are bitching about Pokemon being, like, kept out of the game. Because... Now, those Pokemon are compatible with the games, so you don't have to buy the DLC, and you could still have all the Pokemon that they bring. I Even think a lot of... like, new Galarian forms and stuff like that, just, just with how the game works. People got really, like, uh, confused for some reason by a lot of the uh, messaging in, in the direct. I don't know I think, why. I think people. It's wanted, people who should not have been confused. People who like I, it, whose jobs it is to yes pay mm -hmm. attention. But that's what I'm saying. I think that it was a case of them wanting to like you know double down on the 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 uncertainty surrounding Pokemon in general, where everybody's like, "Am I am I supposed to like this or whatever?" Right. Mm -hmm. So it's like that type of shit. Where people were like, "Oh no, is is uh, uh is the Isle of uh, the Crown, the Isle of Crown or whatever, is that separate from the uh freaking Tundra or whatever?" Yeah, you everyone's know? like, "So you mean like, I gotta pay another sixty dollars?" They, they say multiple times. They say multiple times on the screen and audibly that you cannot buy them separately. It's one expansion pass that is thirty dollars. That's what they said. The only thing that you have to buy, you would have to buy separately, which I mean, like, that's on you at that point. Is if you have sword and shield. Uh, I I my most important question during the whole direct was, all right, how much is this thing? Yes. And then when it said thirty dollars, I said, okay, for each or what? And then I paused the screen, and then it said, you can only buy the expansion pass, and that is thirty dollars. Right. So then that's it. That there it is. Yes. I understand where, like, the layman would be confused by the messenger. I don't understand how people whose jobs it is, is to yes. report on this stuff were confused by the messenger. I think if you're watching a direct, regardless of who you are, it's baffling to me for you to be confused by that because they did, you, you might have missed it, but it wasn't just on the screen. They said that they're part of one pack. Both parts of those are one expansion. Well, pack. also, the direct apparently, like, out. ended. Abruptly. During that yeah. part, when it was supposed to be a little more after that, like that mm -hmm. probably wasn't on screen for everybody. But also, I'm assuming that most people are hearing this information through a third second hand through the people that should be the ones that you yeah. Know so that's you know. where the confusion comes from. Yeah, and that's why like that's a flawed system because a lot of the like bigger ones, for better or worse, for whatever reason, don't even know what they're talking about.
<laughs> like it's like it could be on one hand where it's like you know they're just going with the flow and they're like yeah man the general populace doesn't like pokemon so i don't like pokemon and they're just like perpetuating the messaging that they're gonna hear or it could be someone like you that's not like tuned in to pokemon so you don't really know you're just like you know seeing the direct and be like oh okay this is what's happening so it's like you gotta get your you gotta get your news uh, for stuff like that from the source, especially if it's like a a, a game that is divisive, because the stuff that's going to race to the top is the negative shit. Ah, goddamn! My pyro ball didn't work. Alexis says, "Was there a purpose to buying both Sword and Shield besides the game exclusive Pokemon and the different gym leaders?" No. because I bought shield specifically for the Galarian Ponyta. The idea has always been for Pokemon, you buy one version and then you socialize, you get a friend that has the other version and then you guys like trade your exclusives and do all that shit. Yeah, I'm gonna need a Galarian Ponyta from somebody. Are you serious? Fork it over. Yeah, I'm serious. Okay. What, do you have one? Yes. Pass it on over, buddy. I'm in a battle right now, so not now. Ah, I missed what Pokemon is just pulling out. Um, sure, I'm fine. Oh, hope that's not a water type. <laughs> Damn it, it's a water type. <laughs> yeah, there's like two gym leaders that are different in Shield and uh, Sword. There's like an Ice gym leader in Shield, and then there's like a fucking Ghost one in Shield. Fuck him up. See ya. Beep, beep, beep. Or they're in Dream Eater. The user eats the dreams of a sleeping target. The user's HP is restored by half the damage taken. This is such a good move. But... It's a lot of work. Let me know when you are ready to receive. <laughs> it'll be it'll be a while. Uh, I don't want this move right now. Oh, I missed the freaking Pokemon already. Let me just look around with Sarah Lee. What's her name? Ms. What's her freaking name? Who? Miss Olina, Selena. Oh, wait, why are you looking her up on Sarah? <laughs> oh What's wait, she name? does. She does battle you. I don't forget. It's oh something. Just look up Mister Rose's assistant. <laughs> it's Olina. It's either a Garbodor or a Sa oh, it was a Sazzle. Uh, poison and fire. Geo says, I didn't even care about the dex cut. Pokemon should be mainly focused for kids and older Pokemon you can't get is always annoying for the newcomer. Sea Monsters here, she says, Yandere Olina. Where the fuck is she? <laughs> Who, Sea Monster? Oh, there it is. Are you saying go Olina? Huh? Is who saying what? Yandere is a Japanese term for a person who yeah, that's is like a initially very loving and gentle to someone before their devotion becomes destructive in nature. Was she? I don't feel like she was ever I loving. think maybe Sea Monster is Yandere for Holina. Oh, so she's saying that that's how she feels towards it. I think. But she okay. was most definitely like resentful of you from the start like she was always an asshole <laughs> like i thought from the uh like playing through the story i was like oh yeah she's definitely bad like rose i was like i don't know about him he, i mean he can go like because at the beginning of the game i was like yeah he's probably bad and then like how they interacted where he seemed like the dummy 
and then she's like pulling on the strings. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh yeah, she's the bad one and he's just stupid. But I always knew that something was up with that chick. Oh. Tsukuyomi says, how is Olina's hair even waving like that? They're indoors. She has a personal fan. She has a personal fan. The air conditioner is on blast. Because she is that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Sea monster, how you doing? Pyro ball. <clears throat> the random says, I mean, as long as they have Charizard, which they always have, I'm in. <laughs> Yo, same. Even though, like, if they cut Charizard, I don't feel like I would have cared. Because I didn't use Charizard on my team anyway during the story. Like, I intentionally was like, I'm only catching new shit. <laughs> or shit that I've never used. So Charizard was already disqualified. <laughs> Tsukuyomi says, I can't believe they just recycled the champion fighting room from Sword. I meant it's on the moon. Is that Forward what slash said? sarcasm. No. Tsukuyomi is being sarcastic. Oh. Yeah. Forward slash S. <laughs> Uh, do I have the Dynamax? I guess I have to. Back. Matthew says they will never have cloud save for Pokemon games because they don't want people to exploit it. I wish they would make a way to make it work. I want my save back, my save backed up. How come every other console could have cloud saves for all of their games? There's, like, there's like, definitely a way for them to figure it out. I feel like they definitely could figure. It out. But I also feel like other consoles don't care as much about anti-cheat as Nintendo does. It's just, well, it's not exploitable on other consoles. Like, I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that. Well, well look, um, my, the best example is Splatoon. There's absolutely no reason for that to be as exploitable as it is. Right. Because then freaking people would be uploading and downloading their freaking cloud saves for Call of Duty, trying to get prestige, you know? Yeah. Monster says, just live for that VA life, you know? And I immediately thought she was talking about Virginia, but she's talking about voice acting. <laughs> no, she's talking about uh, being a, a, a war vet. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you were going somewhere else with that. <laughs> I was like, hmm? <laughs> Good thing. Sea <laughs> Monster says, who is your fave Pokemon? He doesn't know. It's Goku. Goku's my favorite Pokemon. Bob always has a different answer. All I got time. a couple answers, right? But my favorite used to be Mew. But if I, if you want to pick a not basic bitch one, then it was uh, what's his name? Now, if I, I, if I don't know the name, then is it even my Skyther. favorite? Skyther. <laughs> Skyther. Yes. <laughs> like Anthony Carboni. I need mean, see. I feel, I I want I want to like just just call it Skyther without any like disclaimer, but no. I feel like people are gonna like freaking you know like they're they're like well, it's not outrageous even, enough. People think that you people don't that. even know what it's called. You know, like it's I mean, not like even know like Gyrad Gyradados. <laughs> when I say that, it's like obviously I'm joking. Yeah, um, but yeah, I can't do it because people will think that I actually think that his name is that. Oh, here's the whole story development situation with uh, Leon. We've discussed this a hundred times already, and still you fail to understand what's at stake. You, who is supposed to be our champion, I think I understand well enough. What I don't understand is why we ought to cancel tomorrow's tournament in order to solve a problem that's a thousand years away from affecting any of us. What difference is one day going to make? My duty as champion isn't this, this madness. Sea Monster said, to be honest, my Pokemon, my Pokemon fave is the most basic, you know. Mine's basic too. Oh, here's a Pikachu. Sea Monster. Oh, hers is more Pikachu. hers is more basic than mine. That's very basic. Mine's basic though. Charizard's my favorite. That is basic. It's basic. It's definitely basic. Mew's pretty basic. Mew's that's like, definitely. That's basic. everybody's like, every ten year old's like favorite when they play. When there was only the first generation, that was everybody's favorite. 
It's carry out that champion match. That's what Galler <laughs> wants and what I want. It's what we've all been looking forward to for so long. Uh, sea Monster's upset. Um, she says, where is the accent? Where is the accent? Wait, hold on. Where is the British? Where is the accent? That is, You're a are, terrible voice actor. What is this delivery? We are not doing that. <laughs> you ain't getting any accents out of me except for a New York accent. And maybe a Boston if you really want. You're not allowed. Uh, there, it's a bitter, bitter rivalry. Uh, you might get stabbed. <laughs> The okay. random knows what's up. If anyone wants to see actual voice acting, you go to see Monsters uh, Twitch. Common Boy says Blastoise is best first gen. You're dumb. Get out. Leave. You're not allowed to be here. <laughs> this is just a still graphic. Look around us, Leon. Look at the gallery region stretched out before us and know that the energy required to keep this brilliant, glittering world alive will be exhausted a millennium from now. The people of Galar today will no longer even exist. What Galar wants today hardly matters. The future is more important than just one day. We must act as quickly as, poss uh, as we possibly can. We must take action in order to avert, avert tragedy so that all can look forward to a better future. I don't understand what they're doing. In a thousand years? Fine, look. I think I understand your concerns, Chairman. And I give my word I'll help you with your plans just as soon as tomorrow's match is over. Lee. Sea Monster said Blastoise. Ew. I agree. <laughs> you never showed when you were supposed to, so I got worried that something had happened. Piers and Marnie and all those Team Yell oddballs, they all helped us get here. And I murdered all of your uh, staff members. I must apologize to you, Hop, if we've made you worry at all. There are times when adults just can't seem to have an honest discussion with one another. Sometimes our pride just gets in the way and he shoots Leon in the head. The random uh, says, wow, this guy got no, this guy's got no patience because uh, you're not a doctor. Oh, shit. That's how he spelled it. Get wrecked. Never mind any of this hop, Bob. <laughs> Let's head back to the hotel and we'll all grab dinner together. Yeah, it's on me. So you can order whatever you fancy. Yeah, that'll fix everything. That'll Common Boy over. says, Blastoise would F up Charizard. Plus, Charizard was a douche in that cartoon. He called All right, well, up. Venusaur would F up Blastoise. So what are you going to do? Yeah, and Venusaur is like the worst one. <laughs> so it's like that fucking doesn't mean anything. Also, you could just get a freaking Charizard X. That's all you got to do. And then it's rip Blastoise. If you'll excuse us, Chairman Rose, and I hope you, I do hope you'll watch tomorrow's match. It's sure to be one for the history. <laughs> See, Monster says, why does everyone sound the same? Put your diaphragm into it. Shut the fuck up, Sea Monster. <laughs> <laughs> one for the history books. You still don't understand, young chairman. We know I am going to change the course of history. Am I supposed to know what he's doing? Like what his plan is at this point? Or does that come later? Um, I mean, he, he explains what the plan is to Leon, but you're not supposed to know until you confront him. Oh, and okay. Then, I haven't confronted him yet. And then he's like, you know, he does the evil villain thing where he's like, here's the, the fucking textbook on how to beat me. <laughs> uh, I'm going to win, third. but all you have to do is hit my big toe, but you're never going to do it. Ha 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 ha. Exactly. Like, all you gotta do is hit the self-destruct button that I have in my lair for some reason. Um, the Serb says Blasto I mean, Bulbasaur is the best first evolution. I hard disagree. Uh, is the best first evolution, but once he turns into Venusaur, he goes to the bottom of the list. I agree with that part, though. I like... Like, Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle are, like, within a margin of error. You know, like, I like those pretty evenly. Um, and then it's, like, Ivysaur. Ivysaur's dope. I like Ivysaur. Ivysaur's probably my favorite second evolution. I think that's because Smash Bros. No, I just like Ivysaur. Ivysaur's pretty cool. I um, think it's only because of Smash Bros. But it's not, though. It's not. Uh, and then Wartortle? Nah. Nah. But Charmeleon, see, Charmeleon and War Total on the same level for me. Where it's like, nope. Um, and then Blastoise is like, he's second place for me. Venusaur was the worst one. There's probably two 
Final Evolution Grass Type 3 that I'm like, yeah, they're pretty good. But Grass usually strays for me. I'm like, nah, you, you fucked it up. <laughs> So we're gonna go get dinner. What happened? I'm hungry. <laughs> this is it. Here at Wyndon Stadium, the greatest stadium in all Galar. You're gonna show everyone the greatest battle ever, mate. And set the world on fire. So go get yourself checked in. Okay. You got it. This oh, always looks like an obese turtle. Oh, they're all rooting for me. Yay. Why don't you guys do that? Because fuck you, you know? Just get me in here. Let's get this going. Will you be heading on to the pitch? The opening ceremony should be starting soon. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> Tsukiyomi said boo. What are we booing? You. Because you said, how come you guys never cheer for me? Oh. <laughs> oh I got to fight Beatty now. I think. I just tried to ride my bike onto the stadium. <laughs> Or if that was like my shtick. Riding your bike everywhere? Yeah. It probably goes without saying, but hello, Galler. I'm your champion, Leon. Chairman's tied up with some business, so I have no one minds. Okay, you're too fast. In order to lead you all to the great side of the Pokemon Center of the Galler region, the time has come for you to battle it on to only the greatest challenger of me. So on behalf of the chairman, allow me to say, let the final matches begin. That's how Leon talks. Are you happy to see Monster? Wait, you. Common Boy says, I'm not a fan of second stage starters of any gen. They all uh, kind of end up ass. I disagree. I like some second forms. They're usually the weird teen years. Yeah, they're definitely usually weird. But there's some that, like, that's when I stop liking them. Like, freaking Chikorita. Bayleaf is where they where Chikorita peaks. And then it just looks fucking dumb. <laughs> <laughs> a moment, if I may. Does anyone here remember me? I am Bede, the challenger who was forced to withdraw from the gym challenge. Bede, he's the challenger endorsed by Chairman Rose himself. I have a score to settle with challenger Bob here. I'm aware that this is against the rules, but I must ask nonetheless. Let me battle him. I'll stake my career as a challenger on this battle. If I lose, I'll retire from being a trainer. Aren't you endorsed by that old lady? What an unexpected turn of events. Former challenger Bead has come for one last battle. We are currently debating what to do with challenger Bead. To all our viewers, both here in the stadium and at home in front of the telly, that's British, we ask that you please be patient. You should just not, we got no time for this, dude. It's a publicly broadcast event. I know this is ridiculous of me, but I had to say something. Do something. Even since you, sh ever since you showed up, Everything I've done has done has gone wrong. It was Olina who asked me to gather wishing stars for the chairman, but then the chairman himself disowned me. And then that strange old lady comes out of nowhere and drags me into a boot camp on fairy type Pokemon. Do you have any idea what I've been through? Covered in pink, dealing with quizzes and battles with fairy type Pokemon every day? And here I am, pouring my heart out to you when you I've never lost my cool before. Okay, just fucking get to the battle. So I guess he left the old lady. Nah. Meganium trash. Sobble's second form was me after discovering a warp door. Says Kensworth. Common Boy says Chikorita is better looking than Bailey's. I disagree. P 
pyro ball this bitch. Where do I gotta get psychic? I got bug. Oh, dark, dark. I got dark. Uh, sea monster said I did beads voice as Cartman. Just thought everyone needed to know that. <laughs> and she said, and now I hear his voice in my head as Cartman. Oh, I forgot to see what he's pulling out. I hope it's the right Pokemon. Oh, they're all psychic and fairy. Okay. This herb says Chikorita is death better than Bailey. I disagree. I continue to disagree. <laughs> Let me see. Let me see this shit right now. I'll be the judge of this. That, that bitch just take out my Morpeko. <laughs> what the fuck did they just do to my Morpeko? Alright, Chikorita Bayleaf. and who else? Bayleaf. Chikorita barely looks different than Cyndaquil. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what does that even mean? How? What? Bay leaf? Like spelled like a bay leaf? B A Y L E E F, I think. It might be E A, but I think it's. A bell leaf is the second one. Yeah. And then Meganium? Meganium is the third one. Third one. Ah, oh, like Meganium. I think though. the whole line looks stupid. The whole line is trash. I think Meganium looked dumb. Uh, Chikorita's alright. Bayleaf is the best one. I think Chikorita... I think Chikorita's the best one. Yeah, I disagree. <laughs> I think they all look pretty bad, but I think Chikorita's the best one. What is this Chikorita. one? <laughs> oh my god. Look at the insides of Chikorita right now. Oh, now what, what the f fuck am I gonna do? <laughs> Some something you said upset Conan boy. Probably a whole. Was it the Cyndaquil looks like Chikorita? <laughs> was that the comment? Cause that that's the one that I was like, what? <laughs> like, I think you might need to get checked. You know what it was on Google Images? You clicked on Cyndaquil from Chikorita, and it's pictures of both of them together. And I, that's why I was like, they look the same. Cause when I clicked on Cyndaquil, I thought it was still Ch it was still Chikorita. Nah, I don't believe you. I think you're just kind I mean, of. It's on the. So you can replay it back if you want. <laughs> I'm not even watching. I'm looking at the chat. <laughs> hey, you know, let's try. Let's try some steel. Let's try some steel moves. How the fuck did my more Paco die? I still don't know what happened. Honestly. Don't think that Gen 2 was the strongest in terms of <laughs> the starters just generally. Oh, because more Peko's dark. I'm stupid. Totodile was best IMO. I agree with that. But see, the thing is, like, I like Totodile. I don't like any of his evolutions, so. I want that. I want a Galarian Ponyta. It's so pretty. I have one right here. Give me. I'm trying. I'm trying. Bulbasaur is better than Venusaur. Change my mind. I don't think. I think that that's just a fact. Honestly, <laughs> I think Venusaur looks dumb. Venusaur is too much. Like Ivysaur is like, ah, you're onto something. He's he's pretty cool. And then freaking evolved again is like, nah, you you went too far. Put him back. Sea Monster says bay leaf is great for rice. You could do bay leaf and rice. Also, for Vindaloo, what is that? I feel the same way about my kid. 
I don't like mudkip either. Mudkip. Vindaloo is an Indian curry dish popular in the region of Goa. You know what? I like um, I like Mudkip more now that I know his design inspiration. That looks delicious. Because he just looks like he's just Mudkip. Like he's just straight up Mudkip. <laughs> like a less saturated Mudkip. Um, but other than that, I was like, just aesthetics wise, I think he looked kind of dumb. I had curry kick a uh, curry chicken katsu yesterday that's what was spicy that i had and it was very good it was at a korean place uh that's right excuse you <laughs> ski is fucking you <laughs> Are you dead yet, Bead? Fuck you, my kid is love. My kid is life. Espresso Boy says the original starters are the quote best because their designs are simple yet complex. I disagree. I have, to sh I have to show Sea Monster a picture of what I ate yesterday. I have it on my Instagram. I think every generation. Oh, it's gone from my Instagram story. Rip. Even with the starters, has strong and weak points. And that is consistent with the starters in general. <laughs> I tried. The random says Gen 4 is best starters. Kind of. I just didn't really get to. <laughs> I don't think there's any generation that I'm like, yeah, that generation starters were solid, dude. Because there's always at least one that I'm like, nope. <laughs> Wait, am I still? Wait, what happened to my Steelix? You trash. I was not paying attention. I keep every time I stop paying attention, I freaking die. I gotta watch the replay now and see what the hell happened. You can't just do that to me. Oh, I, went well, I like the Gen 5 starter designs. I actually, I like the Gen 5 starters. They're good. Alright, whatever. I don't like freaking Tepig though. Tepig kind of though. Oh, you know what? I know what I'll do. I don't full restore. Oh, you bitch bastard. Getting effed up right now by Bead. I think Turtwig messes up Gen 4. Turtwig is garbage. Oh. Got a dark move here. Let's try that out. Uh, the random says, can we all agree Gen 7 starters suck? I don't agree with that. AC's here. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, AC said hi, but he said hi again. Hello! Just go to your highlights slash history, is that a thing? I, I can't do it on desktop. It looks like, anyway. The Serp says Torterra is a boss though, so... I what is what is B doing to my freaking Pokemon, man? He's killing them. <laughs> I, see, I see that. <laughs> Fun um, Dropto Gaming says, "Fuck you, Turtwig is love. Turtwig is life. Turtwig is dumb. Look at the shape of his head." <laughs> uh, Earl Della Cruz says, "Samurott was lit though." See, I think uh, Oshawa's line is one of those things where it's like the again? second one is where it beats. Huh? Say that name again. Samurai. Nope. What? The, the, the other one? Earl Dela Cruz. No, the other one. Samurai? No, the other one. Do what? Nope. Oshawa. <laughs> That's the one. What about it? 
This is a funny name. Okay. Oh, I want Steelix back. Look at the shape of your head. <laughs> Uh, the reason I got a switch light. Did I was was I there for that? I'm a very bad influence on a lot of people. Ah, uh, why not? Let's. Fight. I think you mean influencer. Psychic is neutral against Psychic, but Fairy now. Fairy. It's pretty good. I mean, Psychic's ineffective against Psychic. Oh, good. I finally killed him. Uh, Red says, Oshawa is excellent. Should have had a humanoid third Evo, not Tepe. I agree, because Duat is dope. The Samurai is like kind of, kind of. He, his second Evo switch with his third one, where it's like the awkward one is usually the second one. The third one is uh, is the awkward one for for Ajua. Well, I lost. It looks like Challenger Bead was no match for Challenger Bob and his trusted team. Hey, Bead, that was some match. Don't retire, said. just restart your career. But, but... <laughs> This isn't what I planned. If I was able to defeat you, then everything would be fine. Even if I lost, I was going to use retiring as an ex excuse to get away from that old lady. You just keep messing up my plans. With everyone cheering me on like this, I have no choice but to continue my training as that fiery type gym. But you you made a deal. Though I suppose with my talents, I'll be able to overtake Miss Opal in no time. Now, Challenger Bob, please head back to the locker room so that you can rest up from that unexpected match. All right. Team Monster said, I bought the case, and you were like, you need a switch light for that case. Wait, what an upsell. Where's my commission? Do I have to go anywhere? Oh, no. Get me right back out there, dude. I'm ready to fight again. I like that they do that, where it's like you fucking go in the locker room and you heal and you do all this shit. But I wish that the it was harder because of that. Like I wish the trainers were smarter. Yeah, to like balance it out. Yeah. I like having to go through all of the elite four at once. <clears throat> uh, I don't like that because I think it's it's just like arbitrary. No, it makes it harder. But it doesn't, because you literally just need to spend your money, and that's it. Yeah. That's not difficult. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, what, this is this is a thousand times easier. I think, nah, nah, I disagree. <laughs> I think that they're both equally as easy, it's just you don't need to spend your money to heal. Because the same thing would happen. I would go through a battle. But it also, it also gives end, you your And then I back. would just spam all my four stores and my items and stuff like that. And then I'm done. It also gives you your PP back. Yeah, there's items to do that too. Yeah, but they're paying the ass. No, they're not. Can you, you just buy them at every Pokemon? Poke I don't think you can. You can by the time you get to the end of the game. Oh. Still. It... It... it it, it, it makes it so you don't yeah, have you to do gotta that. You press the A button less, and the, and that therefore yes. the game is yes. inherently easier. I mean, I mean that's the difficulty levels of fucking Pokemon. Is how many that's times do I gotta press the A hard. button? That's not hard. That's just tedium. Te something being tedious is not hard. I don't agree. Yeah, I know we established this, and I think that's dumb. I think you're dumb. I think you're dumb too, but we established that already. Um, what am I doing? Bug and water. All right. Uh, so freaking let's go against bug. Flying and rock. Fire. 
fire. Oh god. This isn't gonna be easy. Hmm. You know what? I'll stick with Bubsy for a hot minute. God damn it. Oh, that's gonna hurt. <laughs> okay. Well, let's hope this pyro ball actually works this time. Oh, apparently you can't buy the ethers. I remember always having a lot of them at the end of the game. Yeah, I remember never being able to get I've, them. I remember never needing to. So I never bought them. But that's the thing. It's like all the only time I use items was in the Elite Four for that reason. Makes the game easier. I think it makes it less tedious. I think they're one the same. Yeah, no, I don't agree with that. <laughs> Dishwasher washes dishes for me. Makes my life easier. That's not a, a checkmate, that's not, buddy. No, that's Check not mate, buddy. <laughs> that's like that's like saying it, it's like oh because I have to run through this as Mario with the superstar. It's harder because I have to run through this part. Whereas if I didn't have to do that, but I go straight to a boss fight. Yes. That, that is would, easier. Yes. It's not. It is. It is. Your argument about the whole freaking uh, doing things multiple times not being harder was that um, it is becomes that it's muscle not hard, memory. It's just tedious. It's that it becomes muscle memory. Which, Which makes it even more, you go through it quicker. It's not something that's like, this so, is so challenging. Would you say, I getting, might die would you say getting good at a game doesn't require skill, it just requires repetition? It depends on what the game is. Any game. Yeah, it depends on what the game is. If it's a single player game and the only thing is like, oh, just do this boss rush or whatever, that's just repetition. That's knowing, oh, he slashes here at this time. But but how do you become good at it? Repeating it. Yeah. That's yeah. developing a skill. That's hard to do. It's not hard. Yes, it is. It's not. And that's where artificial difficulty comes from, and especially in old Right, games. exactly. Keyword being artificial. It's still hard. But it's not. It's still a difficulty. It's just Pokemon it's, it's just, is still, it's just a ma it's a difficulty that is forced upon you. So you're saying you I, I just think that these two statements conflict with each other. If you're like Pokemon's an easy game, but Pokemon is a tedious game. You can say the both both things. But you said tedium is difficulty. It it can be difficult. It, it makes your life harder to have to go through the tedium of it. It makes your life more of an annoyance. Yes, it's annoying. Which isn't hard. It's not hard. It for makes a my life easier where it was harder before. That's why it would be easier. Nah. No? Okay. <laughs> it's not easy. <laughs> I don't want double edge. No, we're good. Mega Man is here. Hi, hello. Hello. Sea King. Oh, I think I'm you good. Can buy oh, okay, that's what it was. You can buy it in like Battle Frontier, like with battle points and shit like that. Is that like the end? Um, It depends on what the game is. Like in this game, you can get battle points before you get to that. Uh, I'm not gonna wood hammer because I don't want to kill myself. Boom, get out. Common voice says enduring the annoyance can be hard. I think that depends on your will. <laughs> yes, well, I agree with him. Uh, no, I'm gonna keep this guy, man. We're doing great right now. Oh, this fucking guy again. 
Oh, he's bug. Damn it. <clears throat> Weak sauce to lead four of this gen. Every gen. Shoot. Ah, let's just hope I one shot him. LOL. No life gamer voices. I'll give Rapidash for Zacian. No scam. Shit! <laughs> God damn it. Oh. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do you turn early again. for really ever that hard though. No, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> I'll still never forget when I was doing Pokemon Yellow and everyone was like, you better fucking watch out, man. You're not ready. It's going to be, oh, you got to do this and that. I'm really sure you can get items that restore PP before the end of the game. They might, yeah, you can. And also you can get like berries that do that shit and berries you can grow. <laughs> yeah, you got to do all this shit where in this game you just fucking restore all of your shit without doing anything. Yeah. What's happening right now? Did I U-turn already? <laughs> Which is streamlining. Oh. I forgot about more Paco. I completely forgot about more Paco. More Paco, you got a new electric move. And you're going to be great. Unless you get aft. Okay, good. Ooh, you know bullets? Wait. I thought Aura Wheel was an electric move. Why did I think that? Because you're dumb. God damn it. I got to go back to the <laughs> stupid ass, dumb ass, stupid ass, whatever it's called. Don't full restore, you <laughs> bitch. See, that's another thing that's easier. I could leave. <laughs> In between battles. Yeah. Oh, it is electric. Oh, it's because I was dark. Okay, yeah. that makes sense. That makes His sense. type changes every other turn. All right, I don't wanna. I don't wanna change that now. I'm happy. I'm happy I have it. Oh, wait, I can't switch. He's flying. Yeah, no, we want to stick with more Pekka. Oh, he's dark now, though. God damn it. <laughs> That's annoying. You don't have any other electric type attack on him? Nope. I got rid... I, I put Aura Wheel in place of Spark. Because that was the only electric tap, uh, attack he knew was Spark. I don't think he learns another one for a while, too. Or you have to get a TM and you gotta yeah, fucking go yeah. into the bullshit and then do all that shit. Oh yeah, you gotta press the A button. <laughs> or you gotta go how find it in the fucking wild areas area. For you. <laughs> you can buy electric type attack. You can buy thunder. I looked. I did like a like an evaluation of all my attacks the other day, and I. I think the one that I wanted for electric, you had to get or something. Or I think he get I mean, more Pekka gets it. It just takes a while. Now he's electric uh, again. So now yeah, I can fuck electric up. type attack or technically electric type attack that he learns is or will after spark, and that's it. The oh, last attack he learns is on level sixty. The splash. So I guess I gotta get thunder. He can get. Uh, wait, what even is he? Is he a physical attacker? Let me see. Dreadnaw. Yeah, he's definitely a freaking attacker. So you want to get like, like freaking Thunder Fang or something, or Thunder Punch. It's also an option.
a grass effect against rock. Uh, uh, nine Pokemon. My favorite is Toxtricity. I think mine's probably Toxtricity too. We're gonna but I like the Pack Man. I just think Toxtricity is ugly. That's really the only reason <laughs> why I <laughs> haven't used them. I loved uh, Yamper, but I didn't really like his evolution that much. And I like more Peko because it's also dumb. I like Tox. I mean, uh, Toxin more than I like Yamper, and also probably more than I like more Peko. I didn't use more Peko. I caught more Peko. It was like the third to last Pokemon that I caught. <laughs> Love my Pokemon. <laughs> Carl Della Cruz says thunder is good when it's raining, and it is raining right now. But I don't have thunder. Would you rather have the powerful attack which I mean anyway, a chance to miss or the slightly less powerful attack that is 100 percent accurate? I think the fact that you can manipulate how accurate it is makes having the most powerful attack what happens. Because literally all you gotta do is make it rain. And that's easy in this game. Especially since they have like the freaking max uh, water attacks and stuff that automatically make it rain. The only reason why I wouldn't, uh, after looking out at the Pokemon stats and shit, why I wouldn't teach more Peko Thunder is because he's a physical attack. Other than that, I would go thunder. What are the uh, what electric moves should I teach him? A thunder fang, a thunder punch. A oh, thunder punch is good. Triton says, "Bob, you don't talk about Tetris 99 in your 8-bit do videos. Why should I? Because of the thumbsticks." I, truthfully, I don't play Tetris 99 that much. Did I say? Thank you for Probably. the Twitch Prime sub, Lizdren. <laughs> no, you did not. <laughs> Lizdren, thank you for the 23 months Twitch Prime subs. I appreciate it. If I didn't say that already. I didn't even know Lizdren was in here. It might have auto renewed. I don't know. And the winner is Bob. You betcha. You bet you got Random it said, Wood's fave is Toxtricity, like, dude, of all time. I, I retract. I don't like Toxtricity <laughs> anymore. <clears throat> all right. Oh, Alexis says, I don't have any shiny Pokemon yet, sad face. I don't either. You don't even got a shiny Magikarp? No. You want I a shiny Magikarp? Know. Hell yeah, I want a shiny Magikarp. Okay. I need I one of them. I need one I of like the pony five. <laughs> Somebody said this shit was going to be quick. This is not quick. This is just stretched out. Ah, I should have moved my phone. It takes long because the fucking middle part. Where it's yeah, like, hey, it's, that dumb stuff. Yeah, that dumb shit. <laughs> oh, okay. he's here. There we go. Hi, hello. Yes, I am here. Oh, Lystra. Fighting and flying. Okay. Oh, I'll hit him with a pyro ball. See what happens. Grimhain says, don't give Bob shiny magic card. And why not? Because he doesn't like you. And why not? Because <laughs> you guys don't like each other. That's the bit. Just eat this pyro ball. Boom. One shot, baby. 
Alright, who's next? Phalanx. Fighting. Oh, just friggin' just get my damn Gardevoir out here. Shkbadoinkle says, Hi, Bob. Short time viewer, first time commenter. Just got a switch for Christmas, and your vids have helped me make good purchasing decisions. Thanks. Well, congratulations. Glad you enjoy. Glad uh, you yeah, enjoy. Magikarp kind of weak, though, isn't it? It evolves in a freaking Gyarados. My. Gyaratidos. Dude. Even though you're a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Gyratidos, you mean? Gyratidos. Yeah, that's what I said. Gyratidos. Gym Leader B is about to send out Surfetched. Will you switch your Pokemon? No. Right? The random says, dude, they're super rare. You're not going to see any if you're not specifically looking for them. Ah, uh, that's not true. What are we talking about? Shinies? Shiny. Yeah. yeah, they're super rare. They are definitely super rare, but you can find them without specifically looking for them. I've done it. I did it this they're just, but generation. It's, but it's very hard because they're not. It's just random. You can literally <laughs> turn the game on, run into a Pokemon, and you find it. <laughs> it's not likely. It is unlikely yes, for that to happen. it's unlikely, but that does not mean it's hard. <laughs> it's hard to want to do it. If you want to run into one, it's going to be hard. Unless you got good Because it is unlikely. Because I wanted a shiny and I ran into Corviknight and it was shiny. Okay, and I want to. It's like course. saying I want to win the lotto and then I win the lotto. And that's, uh, that's easy. Yeah, it's easy not, to win the lotto it's, now. It's not hard, but it's unlikely. That's not. Those aren't mutual. It's hard because the odds are against you. Hard suggests that you have control over whether or not you can do it. No, I disagree. Let's look at that. Let's, let's see what I disagree that difficult. hard suggests that you have control over it. Having low odds means it's hard. Uh, yeah. Uh, the definition of difficult disagrees. <laughs> Needing much effort or skill to accomplish, deal with, or understand. You don't need any skill at all to get a shiny. You, Zero. you could say that it requires effort if you have to repeatedly it, it try does, over and over again to have, get it, and here we it, are again. It does, <laughs> but that's variable. Like, you can literally run into one Pokemon ever in the game and find a shiny. Mm -hmm. The odds are completely random. So it's not difficult. It's just random. It is unlikely. Which is not the same. And if you, if you have to repeatedly look for a shiny over and over again, it's difficult. That's not difficult. Yes, it is. Kensworth says AJ's locked into this narrow meaning of hard. I'm the actual definition of it. No, <laughs> yes. you're overlooking part of the definition. What do you mean, overlooking part of the definition? I just told you what the definition yeah, was. Yeah, you're overlooking part of it. No, I'm saying that what you're you're saying if the the shiny that you're looking for you don't find quickly. Read the definition again. Is not read the definition again. Okay. Difficult. Needing much effort or skill to accomplish deal much with effort. or understand. Much effort. So what was the effort in me running into a Corviknight and it being shiny? What was the it, effort? There? It is unlikely for that to happen. But what was the effort in that happening? You doing it. <laughs> you running into it. Running into it. Okay, so, all right. So that's like that saying logic, it's easy to win difficult. the lotto if you win it one time. I'm saying it's not difficult. It, something not being Would difficult. Would you say it's difficult to win the lottery? Mean. No, I wouldn't well, say it's difficult that's, or easy. That's just wrong. I would say it's, it's difficult unlikely. to win the lottery. I would say it's unlikely, but it's not hard. That's not, those aren't the two, those aren't the same thing because you can't impact whether or not you do it. It just happens to you or it doesn't. I think it takes effort. I think it can take effort, but it doesn't require effort. Oh, so now we're back on that other thing where you're saying that repetition is not isn't hard because it doesn't take effort. 
Yes, it's not difficult. But you just said it can take effort. I repetition. said it can, but it doesn't. You said the repetition can take effort. It can, but it so, doesn't. So now, so now you're going back on that. No, I'm not. I'm saying ah, it can, but ah. it doesn't. I think I got you there, buddy. You didn't, because I just said it can, but it doesn't. I think I did. I think you want to, but you didn't. <laughs> I think, yeah, we, exactly. We, we got Aroidy yeah. says it's not difficult to win the lottery. All you have to do is pay two dollars. It's just odds. Exactly. The odds are what make it difficult. But that's not difficult. If somebody uh, has three is. million dollars and they dump three million dollars into winning the, the lottery, that wasn't difficult. They just spent money and it happened. There's <laughs> that's a not major difficult. risk involved, which is, is part. But of that's not difficult. There's much effort in that risk. I would say, I would argue. Nah. You're putting a lot on the line there. Walking across the street has risk. It doesn't mean that it's difficult. <laughs> well, while there's cars coming, absolutely. No, you just in general. Because, the street in because there's a chance that you can get hit by a car. So therefore, mm -hmm. difficult because there's a chance that it might kill you. <laughs> like that, That's just, uh, those are two different things. If, if it's busy, then absolutely. Because the odds are you're going to get hit by a car. And that's difficult. There are odds that you're going to get hit by a car regardless, but it's not difficult. Yeah, but they're low odds. If the odds are high that you're going to run into a shiny, that's not difficult. The odds can be high that you run into a shiny. But then you got to make the odds like that in this game. Takes the skill of patience if you are searching for a long time. I don't know if I would say that a s patience is a skill. There are people that are patient, and then there are people that are not. I think it can be, <laughs> depending on the, the activity. Yeah, I don't know about that, because patience is just not giving up on a thing. Yeah, or some, not getting some annoyed. Or is that's, just, all in, that's all in your temperament. Some skills is, are just not giving up on something, and that's what makes you good at it. That's not a skill. I try trying to know how hard it is when you aren't getting it in 500x. I've been shiny hunting and it's not hard. I literally walk up to a daycare lady, say, oh, you have my egg? Okay, cool. And then I run around for two seconds. The egg hatches, it's shiny or it's not. That's not difficult. I forgot to switch my Pokemon out again. Uh, Kensworth says, I'm with Bob on the fact that effort can contribute to difficulty. I know AJ as a competitive Smash player has a rigid view of difficulty as the environment frowns upon luck-based outcomes. No, I don't think that has anything to do with why I don't agree with that. Um, because like it, 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 my view of something being difficult and something not happen to you often or it's unlikely or whatever, depends on the amount of effort that you can put into getting something. If I can't put in more effort, exerting effort on something, and that makes it more likely, then that is, that's not difficulty. That's just random odds. Me doing, uh, me shiny hunting more does not mean that I'm more likely or that it becomes easier to get the shiny. I could literally never find a shiny and I can only be trying to hatch eggs and it still never happened to me because odds don't work like that. It's not like, oh, the odds are one in 400, so that means I just gotta hatch 400 eggs. That's not true, because every egg that you hatch has the same odds. The odds don't decrease the more you hatch eggs. God damn it, I'm asleep. <laughs> Who is your greatest Pokemon? Who is your strongest Pokemon? Me? Yes. I think it might be Inteleon for some reason. And he's about to get fucked right now. <laughs> 
Is he awake now? No, he's not awake. The random says, actually they do. They don't. <laughs> one, you can cap your shiny odds. Your odds are capped at once you have the shiny charm and you have Masuda method and blah, blah, blah. They stay at one in 400. If you hash 50 eggs. If, I, if I go to stuff. Vegas uh -huh. and I'm looking at the, the game with the best odds, people would go, play that one. It's easy. Right, and that, that comes down to how people uh, relate words to a meaning, generally. Just like the sour. It's not, that, it's not this fucking complicated. <laughs> it's not this complicated. Shiny hunting, finding a shiny is hard. And it's that, not. And that's it. But it's not. <laughs> it's just unlikely. Salazar says, whoever this other guy talking is, he's an idiot. I mean, you could have said that with correct grammar at least. <laughs> <laughs> Why does this fucking Pokemon, this fire Pokemon, no solar beam? That's what I want to know. Don't put me asleep. Do not do this to me. <laughs> Alright, we're good. Ugh. Yep. Now I'm asleep. God, well, I don't need you anyway. Who are you even battling right now? Oh, the dragon guy. John Halstead, Halstead, with two dollars super chat says, "Please stop fighting dads." <laughs> right, everybody else is dragon, so I should be good. Should be good. But Inteleon had ice moves. Yeah, Dazzling Gleam, do it up. Oh, thank you for the $2. <laughs> Salazar said he doesn't even understand grammar. Get someone else. Reread your own message. <laughs> Uh, no, I'm good. I'm good with Gardevoir. I mash A too much. This guy's not even looking at me. Wait, why is it just regular effective and not super effective? And Yubla says, being time consuming can make it hard for some people. Put your fucking flag in the sand and say it's easy for you, but you don't get to define easy. I didn't say that it's inherently easy. I'm saying they're not the same thing. Something having low odds does not make something hard or easy. It just makes it unlikely. If if you get the shiny on the first try, because the odds, because you just, just roll the dice and you get a shiny on the first go. You put the exact you would, you would thing. Say, you would say, that was easy. That was quick. <laughs> you would say, that was easy. I would say it's easy either way. But it's not easy for anybody else. They, they would say that is hard to get a shiny because the odds are not I would in my say favor. If, I would say if I hatched 3,000 eggs for a shiny, it would still be easy. It just took a long time. Yeah, you, you got a very, very skewed idea of the definition of difficulty. Yeah. I 
Uh, you are going to butcher all the odds of any Pokemon egg hatching into a shinier fix, repeating them to infinite deg uh, degrees. You should... Ah! <laughs> you should eventually get a shiny, but it's RNG. Not easy, just lucky. But exactly. Hi, Cocahannis. <laughs> Gene Cough says, I think we can all agree Bob needs to make Wolf Den sweatpants. That will never happen. I need to start making spring shit, like, now. <laughs> no, it lowers that. Yeah, that's the random. That's what I said. It does. It lowers from true odds of 1 in 4,000, but they cap at 1 in 400. And once you get to the 1 in 400, that's what it is. Who's next after this guy? Oh! It's friggin' Leon. Oh, shit. What line of Leon am I gonna have? Does he have... Since I have Cinderus, does he have Inteleon? Yes. Oh no, oh no, okay. Alright, we're good. Good, everything's fine. Do the move. Do your move. Don't make me use Max Rebot. Ah, oh, you suck. I'm fine, I'm gonna do a fucking potion. Uh, I don't know how to say this person's name. They said, you can land a really difficult half-court shot. The probabilities are low, but you can do it. Is it hard? It's fucking hard. I would agree that that's hard, because it takes physical effort <laughs> to do it. <laughs> and more effort than putting a ball in a hoop. Like, just putting your hand over the hoop and dropping the ball in? God damn it. So ironically, that, that's kind of more along the line of what I would say is hard. The reason for this whole disagreement is that uh, you don't as, think that taking a long time to do something is hard. Right. And I think that it is. And I think... And that's I, just... Yeah. Case closed. I think, I think that's exactly what it is. I think... I think something taking a long time because like i can uh put a puzzle together over a long period of time i can just put one puzzle piece onto the, the board and then it take me a month to finish the puzzle just because i only put one piece on the board at a time that doesn't mean it was more hard to do that than it would have been if i just did it all at once and that's what i'm saying <laughs> i think that's dumb and you're stupid I agree, but for you. <laughs> uh, all right, fine. Let's get sleeping Bubsy out here, why don't we? <laughs> Better wake your ass up. You're about to get hit by a building. All right, good. Building's gone now. <laughs> Oh god, oh god, please don't kill me. Alright, All right, Mike, bye! <laughs> please don't kill me. Oh, that's gonna kill me. Fuck. Hmm. more Peko a shot, you know? 
Makai, pro tip, if that's what you want, say something different in the chat and that's what I'll read, but everybody's still talking about that. Crunch his ass, crunch. He just needs a little hurt. He just needs a little hurt. And that's it, that's all he needs. It's also about the championship. I actually prefer it over the Elite Four. I agree. I like it when the game is more like the anime. Because it's like this fully realized world that they're just not taking advantage of. Yeah. I'm cool with the story elements and all that. It's just the dialogue is so drawn out. Yeah. Just like get to the fucking point. Yep. Why am I disconnected from the anime? The game does that. You are approaching the software limit. Uh, <laughs> what did I do? Hold on, I gotta close the game real quick. Some people, why did my switch disconnect? Kensworth said, like, did we ever figure out what a range and stove are? Yeah, uh, Bob's that mom decided that. <laughs> we got to the bottom of that. I have a, I'm wired right now. That we, we got to the bottom of in the same stream. Also, I had a friend the other day say range in like a sentence. Like instead of- Oh, I like he's, just, just talk about that. He <laughs> said, yeah, I could make that on the range instead of saying the stove. That's wild. That's yeah. I I was like, I was like, excuse me. <laughs> and honestly, if we never had that conversation, I would have no idea what he was talking about. Yeah, <laughs> I've I'd literally be like, you never have a, heard you have anybody a say whatever. That I mean, that's why I was like, when your mom mentioned it, when she was like, oh, it's called a range. You're like, what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Come on, let me just fight the champion here, all right? All right, buddy. Am I all good now? Oh, what do I want for the first Pokemon? This, I keep messing this up. I want Steel Slash Ghost. I'm good with Bubsy. Yeah, Bubsy it is. Oh, he's got a pretty high ranking Pokemon. Endula says, Bobby, call your mother to settle, the, settle this again. No. <laughs> No. I just whistled on the way out to the field. That'll be my thing. I whistle like before, I, before I walk out on the field, you hear a whistle. I freaking never use that in this game. I don't, oh, it's to like call Pokemon over. Yeah, like I, I do it like by accident sometimes. I'm like, oh shit, I forgot that this is a thing. <laughs> Oh, I know that. I'll fix up my camera. Okay, there we go. The tents still air on the pitch. And the exact opposite from the audience, cheering and yelling. They're both fantastic, wouldn't you say? But remember, the audience is also a bit cruel. They want nothing than to see one of us lose after all i like how he's out of focus is very uh, great cinematography in this game it can fill you with fear knowing that but i absolutely love pushing past the fear i love giving it everything i've got as a trainer and seeing my team give everything they've got to seize another victory it's the greatest feeling in the world and i can't get enough of it i can feel my partners itching with anticipation inside their pokeballs we're going to have a real champion here I'm the Galar Regions champion, Leon, and me and Charizard and the rest of our team will use all our knowledge and experience to uh, crush you completely. All right.
Wait, hold on. Hey, look at the monitor. What is that on the big screen? Uh-oh. Next position. Hello there, Leon and Bob. Just letting you know. I put a bomb in the field. I think it's time I, bo I brought about the darkest day for the sake of Gala's future, of course. This is very stupid. <laughs> uh, a bit of a pickle. To oh, I, I didn't read it in time. I'm sorry it's come to this, but it's you who forced my hand, Leon. You refuse to listen. Do I have to do some bullshit before I get to the fight? Lee, Bob. That video stream, that was from Hammerlock Stadium, right? What in the world did the chairman do? I don't know, but everything he was saying yesterday, did he really pull that crazy stunt to solve some problem a thousand years in the future? I've got to go see what's going on. I'm the champion. I have to go. I should have realized what the chairman intended to do before it came to this. I'll take responsibility now for fixing this mess. This is the real champion time. But Lee, you're terrible at directions. <laughs> what if you get lost along the way? What a dumb reason. I want to help my brother, Bob. I've got to, but I can't even imagine uh, manage to beat you. So what sort of help could I ever be? Just fucking, it doesn't... It doesn't mean that you're bad. It just means I'm great. Easy for you to say. Hold the phone. The chairman was talking about the darkest day. That's that thing where the sky went all dark. Once ages ago, right? What does he mean? He's bringing that about? And where did we even hear that name? That statue of the hero in, in Moto Stoke. Sonia said something back then, didn't she? Uh, though it turned out to be wrong since there were actually two heroes all... Uh, yeah. Still, those two managed to bring on bring an end to the Darkest Day with a sword and shield Pokemon. Sonia thought the Pokemon might still be sleeping somewhere though, right? We should try to find them, Bob. But where to start looking? Oh my god, can we just get in on this shit? That's it, Bob, I'm sure. Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's go. I was all excited to finish the game. <laughs> now I gotta do this shit. Huh? Bob and Hop? Ah, I completely forgot about the championship match. What are you two doing here? Have you been watching the news at all? The tournament is off, Sonia. The chairman saw to that and to sending the entire region into... Okay, can we just get on with this? There's no reason to repeat yourself. Oh, are we doing the legendary thing now? Uh, I don't know. Hold on. Yes. Yes and no. <laughs> oh, God. You don't actually catch the box legendary until post game. I'm starting to annoy me. <laughs> Running out of time here. God. Oh my god, I don't have that. I need the Galar. Uh, <laughs> I need the, the, the glare and wheezing. I need it. 
Brandon from BX says, AJ is literally in every stream. What's up, man? Just the Sunday one. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> I'm doing good. How are you? Actually, that's not true. Fuck. Not just the Sunday ones. <laughs> Sometimes other ones. Depends on what it is. If it's Smash Brothers, or a Wolf Den Live about Pokemon, or a Sunday stream. Guaranteed Sunday ones. Yeah. Sundays are the only guaranteed. Ah, uh, this might kill him. I hope this doesn't kill him. Well, there's another one right around the corner, so... Oh, don't self-destruct? I didn't know you could do that. Oh, that's annoying. Wait, who self-destruct? Weezing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He gets that. Ah, oh, come on! It was the last. It was the last one. Hey, you go to the freaking. <laughs> Yo, I don't think I've seen freaking Galarian wheezing self-destruct. A wild one, anyway. He did it twice. No comment. I was. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I just freaking. I just threw a, a quick ball at him, and he stayed in there when I called him up. He he freaking rattled four times and then got out of the freaking quick ball. Four times. That's not even possible. Many times. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna keep him poisoned because I'm about to run into another one. Ooh, what's this? Should I use. Oh, wait, I don't even think I have a Master Ball. What, use your Master Ball on freaking, uh, Galarian Weezing? No. <laughs> <laughs> on the fucking, uh, Legendary. I didn't. On the first Legendary that you run into, I used the Pokeball. Um, the Box Legendary is Ultra Ball. This is very annoying. He's just gonna freaking uh, self-destruct again. He might not. Slug bottom, okay. Yeah, well, I gotta hit him again, though. He might self-destruct now. Oh, don't kill him. Oh, God. All right, good, we're good. Meow says, remember back in the good old days when poison hurt you outside of battle, does it not? Do I not have Ultra Balls? Oh, there we go. What the fuck, man? <laughs> I self-destructed again! Don't kill me. Oh, he killed me! You piece of shit. All right, I'm giving up on these guys. I'm mad now. That's so annoying. Oh yeah, no, since freaking Gen 5. I didn't even notice that. What, they don't hurt you anymore? Outside of battle, anymore. yeah. That's weird. I, I just, I think I never noticed that because you heal point, you heal status affliction for free in those games. Cause all you gotta do is freaking go to Pokemon and me or refresh and then you can heal it with the, the stuff. Just gonna use up my super potions. There we go. All right, which freaking way am I going? This dumbass place. Oh, a Pokeball. Misty Seed. That's an interesting name. 
Oh my fucking god. Kensworth said, Bob, would you say catching a wheezing has been hard? <laughs> <laughs> I just think Bob has bad luck. So maybe his life is hard. Life is hard. Is it hard or annoying? Yeah, exactly. You know. You can't, it could be both. I think it can be both. I, I don't, don't think they're mutually exclusive. I don't <laughs> need a corp knight. New copy pasta inbound, boys. Oh god, just ban Thank him you. now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want. Uh, I'll try. I'll go for this one. I don't think I'm going to beat this game by the time it hits uh, 11 o'clock. Oh no, probably not. Especially if you try to catch the legendary. Oh well, of course I'm going to try to catch the legendary. I'm going to try Pyro Ball. Oh, if you're trying to catch the box legendary, you're not doing that on this stream. That's not going to happen within the next, I'd say, hour. Fuck. I killed Weasel. like a map. No. Ah. It has to be this way somewhere. Get away from Chances my face! One and four. Oh wow. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen a freaking because the first one I saw I caught. And then the rest of them I ran I ran away from. <laughs> hey about damn time. Don't make me fight anything else. <laughs> I'm gonna be here forever. Yep. Oh, I wanna. No, oh, I went this way before. Okay. Alright. <coughs> God bless ya. Thank you. Meep, meep. Oh, are we good? Oh, I found a... Okay, we're doing... We're making progress. Hop! Hello! Isn't it great to see you? What type well, uh, is the legendary? Um... Oh, there he is. Steel and fairy or some shit. Oh, no, his, uh, his normal form is, like, fairy. Just fairy. And I think his, like, full thing is, like, fighting in steel. And I can catch it now? No. No? I have to kill it. You can try. <laughs> I can try what? Killing it. I don't think I don't think you have Oh you're you're doing are you in the place already or are you still in that forest thing? I'm in the forest. Yeah, I don't think you can kill it. I think it's like a story thing, something happens. But I you can try to kill it. Can I catch it? No. Okay. You can't catch it into the post game. Okay, so I don't have to worry about killing it. Yeah, no. Okay. Even when you, I, I'm pretty sure even when you go to catch it, you can kill it, and it's like he was testing you or some shit, and then you can you can try catching it again. Okay. 
I really hate his biking outfit. It makes it makes it like really takes away from the whole like game, <laughs> the whole like like look Being of this to, area. Yeah. Oh yeah, everything's all like dark and mysterious. And he puts on his like bright colored like neon uh, biking outfit with the helmet and the ring, the bell rings. Hey man, at least he doesn't have like one of those windmill things on top of it. <laughs> hey man, at least he's safety first, you know. Yeah, exactly. He's even more safe in the expansion. He got a full fucking motorcycle helmet on. Oh shit, I didn't know that. <laughs> Alright, now I'm in the place. What place? I don't know, there's a sword and a shield. You know, like the like the like the name of the game. Mm -hmm, yeah. That's a place. That's not the place that you catch. Oh, it well, it is. It's the place that you catch this Pokemon in, but you're not anywhere near that. <laughs> you got to go through a whole freaking post game situation to, to beat that. All right, I took the sword because I ain't no bitch. I don't agree. Fairy uh, steel when holding this item. Summons into the same but fighting. Oh, okay, yeah, that's what it is. Uh, AJ sure, let's game. go. Right Bob, there. don't give a fuck. Plus, we're, th th this stream was going to be a spoiler. I anyway. was. A I asked. I'm going to ask. Well, if it isn't Bob and Hop. It's a real shame the way things have turned out. You make it all the way to the championship match, then something like this has to happen. And Chairman Rose, thinking that the energy pouring from the darkest day would somehow be the key to saving Galler's future? It all seems a bit mad, if you ask me. I can't follow all, at all how that's supposed to work. Well, I don't care if I'm up against the darkest day or the chairman or whatever. I'm going ahead. I'm off to help my brother. You should help too. Man, you're a friggin' dragon trainer. And he's gone. That hop never changes. Always in a rush about something, isn't he? The key thing is that no one's been harmed. We, we okay. All right. Uh, do I need to heal? Mm. Yes, I do. My PP is low. Uh, you should talk to a doctor about that. <laughs> yeah, the two things about spoilers. One, you know this is the end of the game. You're watching it. And two, uh, this game's been out for months now. So. Truth. Get with it. G -G Gym Challenger, you must help me. I mean, please help me. My Pokemon suddenly Dynamaxed for some reason and started running amok in the stadium. Alright. I'll help you. Now look who needs help. Does this mean all my Pokemon are going to be Dynamax? Because that would be sick. No. It doesn't mean that. <laughs> that would be sick. Dynamax Pokemon rampaging. Miss Olina losing her cool. Everything's turn been turned on its head. Please, you must help Mr. Rose. Yeah, let me. <laughs> Grimane said, Bob's PP is low, folks. No wonder he needs the racing wheel to entice the girls. <laughs> it would have been better if he said babes. You should have said babes. The Fuck racing wheel of... <laughs> Yeah, he's talking about that. Did anybody use the like the small, like the freaking the little one? Is that or is that the only one that you put out? No, I put both of them out. Oh, did anybody use the small one by choice? Uh, I think I think Jerry did yesterday. You know what? That doesn't surprise me. <laughs> uh. 
And what do you plan on doing, Jim Challenger? Stopping the darkest day? I should have said help. Who's all coming to PAX? Day. Is freaking is Greg Greg and uh, I don't know. He Greg last year he he was at the last minute saying he was coming to PAX. This year I'm I can't we're not doing a panel, so I can't get any extra passes. Oh, yeah, sure. Last year, really, the only reason Greg went is because I had an extra pass. Because we did the pa panel. It's not that it stopped now. We've already brought about the Darkest Day, or should I say the ultimate Pokemon. Is I, James coming? Or is yes, it just he is, he is oh. definitely coming. I just got us both train tickets. Hey. Most explain where it's from your perspective, I suppose it must seem that I am doing something terrible. I don't expect you to understand, but I must provide the Gala region with limitless energy to ensure everlasting prosperity. It is my purpose, my duty, my destiny. But what's the downside to this? Downside to what? What he's doing? To the freaking Dynamax situation. I don't know. I think it's like a freaking like a, a global warning. A global warming. Uh, Allegory? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. That's why we've been giving the wishing stars to Eternatus. Eternatus. Is that how you say that? Uh, I don't know. I haven't heard it said Eternatus. It sure um, Eric says, take your clips guy next year. Clip more stuff. <laughs> Surely you remember the red light that caused a ruckus around Hammerlock. That was all part of our experiments to awaken Eternatus. 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 You must understand, I can't let you interfere with my plan to protect the future of Galar. I don't... I still don't know what you're even doing. He's using freaking Dynamax energy to power the fucking place, man. To warm the globe. I also don't know what Pokemon is. Throwing everything out of whack. Pokemon are determined shit and shit. Like, you know. It's all yeah. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Cerebi? I need, I need Cerebi. Eric said, there were like five this week. I'm gonna clip every damn thing now. <laughs> You don't, you don't need to clip all of Wolf Done Live. <laughs> you do not need to do that. Uh, next time, Bob and Will fight about fucking Captain... Uh, fucking... I don't even remember what the movie's called. Captain Marvel <laughs> and Wonder Woman. <laughs> next time they talk, fight about that shit, clip that. Oh, this is the energy plant? Okay. Bug and steel. All right, dude, a freaking pyro ball and you're dead. See you. What else you got, little bitch? Oh, they're all steel. All right, I got this. I think somebody said that in, in the chat earlier. You're pretty tough. Okay. It is Captain Marvel. I wanted to say Miss Marvel for some reason. <laughs> That's a different person. That is also, yeah, exactly. That's also a character that they had. Who's going to be in the Avengers game that looks shitty? Yes. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I'm good. <clears throat> Eric said, I'm just going to make Will Was Right clip compilations and Bob Hayden on Wonder Woman videos all well. You got to make ones that will you get could, views. <laughs> uh, you can make Bob Was Wrong compilations. I was going to say Bob Was Right, but that doesn't happen, happen really well. Uh, he was right about Switch, but everybody on the internet was right about that. Um, yeah, excuse me, but they wrote articles about me. Yeah, they did. They did. Yeah. That's true. You're right about that. Court put, change. Put that in the compilation. With this <laughs> mysterious power, the user swaps the effects on either side of... No, I'm, not, I'm never using that. Gotta get on that funny Wolf Den clip compilation. Yeah! 
You off that in funny moments. Yeah. Like the Smash Brothers one you did. That was great. I don't even, I don't even know what you're talking about. You talking did about a Smash one... Brothers clip compilation when we were doing doubles that one time. Oh, yeah. You're talking about the... I thought you were saying he did another one. No, no, no. You're talking about the one that the guy was like, dude, you can clip when I won or some shit like that. And it's like, dude, you got freaking two O's. <laughs> <laughs> Grimane said, AJ, you can't make Bob was wrong clips. You just clipped the whole stream or podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, that's a good idea. Says Eric. The funny moments one? <laughs> uh, anime triggered said, you all played that new Terminator Resistance game, lol? No. Nope. Didn't even know that was a thing. I gotta look that up. Uh, a beep. This doesn't look new. Wolf021022 says, hello. <laughs> hello. It's a shooter? Looks like it came out in, like, November. Oh my god, I hate that. Oh, it came out in December. Can I fire Eric? Sure. Eric, you're fired. He said, yeah, I'll call that Wolf Den Quips. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is why he's on the payroll. <laughs> <laughs> Not anymore, you just told me I could fire him. Nah, he's back so, on, yeah, I like you it. You know what, rip. <laughs> Vetoed. Damn. I'm down, down with it. Wait, do, do I want to die on Max? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we're, we're, we're dying on Max. Grimhane says, "Okay, okay. Starting next week, I'm going to be nice to Bob again for a while because I've been teasing him a lot these last few weeks." Thanks, Grimhane. Start next week. <laughs> you gotta balance out the force. <laughs> next week is in like freaking an hour and ten minutes. I, I start my week. Well, it depends Sundays. on. I was. Charmaine's gonna mark on his calendar next Sunday. Be nice to Bob today. He's gonna put an alert in his phone. This week is be nice to Bob week. I mean, I'll say, does AJ have the power to fire anybody? Sure. Uh, I mean, you're sure. fired as long as you don't agree. I mean, as long as you agree, <laughs> I can suggest things. Yeah. Which is, you know what? That's a lot of power because this isn't my channel. <laughs> um, but I have the power to fire people on my channel. That I have full power there. Here, I, I'm like, I can like, I'm like the He's house. He's a board member. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm like Congress or the house where I'm like, I can suggest a thing, but more people need to agree with it. True. Uh, Grimhane says, AJ is correct for what I intended, starting Monday. So, you know, I get Grimhane, you know? Hey, the saying. both of you. <laughs> I don't... Alright, that was the easiest thing I've done in a while. You know what? Not even... <laughs> not even want to touch that. I'd forgotten how great Pokemon battles are. It's been so long since I battled. That sure was satisfying. And now you're just never now you're just gonna stop your crazy plan. Most impressive, Bob. I wouldn't expect any less from a challenger endorsed by the strongest champion ever to grace our beloved Gala region. I really do wish I could have seen the championship match between you two. And I'm terribly sorry to have ruined the whole gym challenge and everything. It's too bad, but it can't be helped. In order to solve the energy issue as soon as possible, we awakened Eternatus, but we couldn't control it. The champion came to aid me, even at the cost of abandoning the match. Indeed, just like a knight in shining armor coming to rescue a princess from a dragon. I do intend to ramble on, I know. I love to make speeches, but I think I can stop talking now. I think the champion should have captured Eternatus by now. 
If you're curious, you can take the lift up. And I trust you'll be going to right hop. I certainly hope losing to me didn't discourage you too much. Go on now, both of you. Go see how your champion is. Oh, so this is the guy you were talking about. The Who rose? The legendary. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yep. It's the one I caught in the Pokeball. So I can catch this one? Yes. Okay. I will catch it. Um, Meow said, well, considering how your argument about difficulty went, I don't know, man. I don't even know what that's referring to. And how it went was it just, we just stopped talking about it. <laughs> so I don't know, I don't know. Inconclusive, whatever you, where, your point is here. <laughs> where is the lift? Is this the lift? I'm upset you just called it a lift. They called it a lift. It's because they're British. Well, yeah, I'm just, you know, uh, when in Rome. <laughs> <laughs> Let's freaking get a move on. But Oh, okay. We're just going then. We're just, okay, that's not a lift. That's just teleporting. Chuck a nest ball at it. 100% catch rate for an eternity. Oh, I should have left. Yeah, like, I feel like that's probably the most disrespectful one you could throw at it. So probably do that. <laughs> nest ball? Does that actually work? Yes. Do I have one? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Do I have anything that restores PP? What does restore PP? Oh, elixir. Elixirs and... Do I have a regular region. elixir? I don't need a max elixir. I only have one. I probably oh, we're fine. We're fine. We'll go. We'll go into it anyway. I've never seen this Pokemon before in my life. Now, can I take his health all the way down? In the raid battle, yes. In the raid battle, what does that mean? I mean, there's like a raid battle situation. That's gonna happen right now. Yeah, I, I mean, I think it should already happen. Hold on, wait, let me see your screen. Yeah, you need to help me. Yes, it is happening now. Okay, so I can take his health all the way down. Yes. Okay. He's, I'm, yo, you know what? Respect, because he threw a Pokeball at him too. <laughs> <laughs> he broke in half. Why is he hurt? <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Yo, he got freaking uh, shrapnel fired at him. It's just his spirit. Oh, my spirit! <laughs> Did I ever tell you about this story when um, I was like, I was freaking, I was with my brother and we were sitting down on my bed and he was getting on my nerves so I pushed him off the bed and he started crying. Um, and I was... <laughs> I was like, why are you crying? And mind you, this is my younger brother. He's four years younger than me. And he was like, I don't know, like it's five when this happened. Um, and he was crying. I was like, did that actually hurt you or did it hurt your pride? And he was crying. He was like, it hurt my pride. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you don't, you don't even know what that means. But it was That's like, Leon right now. <laughs> he got ball busted. Says beef dippings. I should not be that using means. Bubsy right now, but I guess that's what we're doing. Ah, I should have used. Oh no, never mind. Ignore me. Oh, I'll let my Bubsy die. <laughs> Gene Cop said, "I want to know what qualifies as some qualifies someone as an esport expert after seeing one on the Today Show." Sounds sauce. I re I hate all of that. Shit. <laughs> like industry <laughs> analyst. I hate that so much. Insider even annoys me. Cause like there's no real qualifications that happens that like that freaking Marcus Sellers dude. People were calling him an industry insider and he was just fucking throwing shit at the wall and so it stuck. Literally. <laughs> and taking random DMs from like unverified people. They're just like, like, yo, man, I heard this leak for Smash Brothers, and they just named a whole bunch of shit, and then he was like, um, 
I was like, oh, I heard from a uh, an undisclosed source that this shit is going to happen. And then the guy that sent him that just outed him. I was like, hey, I'm the one that did that. I have three followers. Or <laughs> whatever. Man, people have got low standards. Oh my god. Oh, uh, we want to do psychic. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Okay. So I can kill him now in this stage. Yes. Okay. And he's dead. Yo, this is dope. <laughs> Oof. Oh, this is from the trailer. Wow. <laughs> it is. Oh, don't put Bubsy out. He's not going to make it. Wow, it's huge. Let's take it together, Bob. That's a, a one way to put it, Hop. <laughs> Jinkoff said, industry insider is so sus. I talked to a pro player once, and therefore, what I think is insider information. <laughs> what? I can't use any moves. Can I freaking Dynamax yet? Due to a mysterious power. I forgot, we found the sword and shield and the slumbering... Oh, do I gotta, like, fucking give it to him? Don't I have to give him a sword? Give who's? I don't know. Every time I do a move, it says it's not working. I, I think have... the I think the legendary is gonna pop up and help you. Oh, so I just gotta keep going. Bob, use that sword. It might be old and rusted, but oh, I was like trying to equip the sword. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, hurry up. We're over time now. Got things to do. Oh my god, they're they're they made it. Yup. Oh my god, that's the, that's the game. That's the name of the game. What two sword a sword and a shield Red and blue in the sky and they exude energy and then they fucking fuse with doggos. Now they they fuck. <laughs>
Now this is the part when you gotta get effed. I would buy a DLC if it was all just this. <laughs> Gee. Did he just avoid my fireball? Oh, you motherfucker. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it, Bubsy. Good job, Hop. <laughs> Glad to have you on the team. Ash Dreamer says, All right, guys, have a good night, Bob and AJ. It was fun watching and listening to the debates. Good night. Uh, good night. Fuck him up. Boy, that was sick. BB Retro says, I think it would have had a better chance of being called Pokemon Arrow over Gun, but Gun would have been hilarious. Yeah, I don't think anybody actually believed it was going to be called Gun. It just would be funny. <laughs> oh my god, that did nothing. But now we know that it's crown and fucking armor. <laughs> I am not helping this fight at all. Boom! Break your break. Fuck him up! Do more of that! Just fucking hits him with his shield head. <laughs> Yo, am I gonna do my move? Yeah. Oh my god, it did nothing! <laughs> I gotta switch Pokemon, and this, this is completely useless. Uh, Nick Province says, God, what happened to Pokemon? This is so over the top, it's like what happened to the Fast and the Furious series. Uh, they got more powerful hardware. <laughs> The whole, the whole game is not like this. This is just the end of the game. Yeah. I think they always intended Pokemon to like feel like this, where it's like everything's like, oh shit. Yeah. Everything's all over the place and stuff blowing up and there's a big old thing right in front of me and I gotta fight him with my friends. But the Game Boy can't, can't uh, deliver that. <laughs> Uh, Coriander says, is the Pokeball Plus worth getting for Sword and Shield? I saw a guy on the train with a Pokeball Plus the other day, and next to him was a guy with a Switch. But they were too far away to take a picture of both of them at the same time. <laughs> Just for Pokemon Sword and Shield? No. I would say if you're going to use it with, like, Pokemon Go, then yeah, it's worth it. Mine is broken. Are you serious? Yeah, it doesn't turn on. Wait, should it... Is it just dead? Uh, no, it doesn't charge or anything. Damn, how did that even happen? There's a way to reset it, but that doesn't work either. Oh shit, the That's legendary's okay. dead. Psychic, do it! Fuck him up! Oh no. One more psychic should do it. Bye. 
I forgot you can charge. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. Let me just try to charge it. <laughs> Dead as shit. Come on, kill it, kill it. Yeah! Get aft! Now what Pokeball should I use? Any of them. What is the most effective one? Any of them. It has a 100% catch rate. Oh. Okay. A oh, regular Pokeball then. That's what I use, because fuck them. Yeet! It'd be kind of messed up if it went through all this pomp and circumstance and it just broke out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Still yeah, play Pokemon yeah. Go. Yup, it had its most profitable year last year. <laughs> Woo! Wow! Those guys are so cool. I reached level 40 like three years ago. I didn't even reach level 40 still. <laughs> In Pokemon Go? Yeah. Yeah, I'm only like a 25. I think I'm around there too. I'm on top of a Pokestop right now. Cheating. Alright, well we didn't finish it. But we got the cool Pokemon. Oh, did you still? Oh, yeah, that's fucking. It's a poison and a dragon. I will literally never use Eternatus. The thing sitting in the box forever. Sometimes I use Zacian for uh, raids. I think he might be able to replace my Steelix. Oh, that's a bitch move. <laughs> All right. We out. Goodbye. I don't know when I'm going to finish this game. Maybe on Twitch. Because uh, it'll be a short stream. I'll just fucking. Hey, that's beat what you it. thought about this one. <laughs> Well, we'll beat it, and then we'll do, like, raids or something. You still got the post game at the end, though. And what's that? That's where you catch the actual legend there. The oh, of the so I could do a whole stream on that. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if you still don't beat it on that stream at this pace. Uh, but maybe. Does it say how long I've been, how many hours i put in this stupid game? When you save the game. Let's do it again. 23? Oh, that's not that much. No, 30. 30. All right, goodbye, everybody. I'll see you all on Tuesday for a video on both of our channels. Yep, I'm making a video about the Pokemans. I think I'm doing one on all the games coming out this year that don't have dates. That's a lot of games. That's a lot of games. Surprising. You know what? It, Unless not you're a... just talking about Switch games. If you're just yeah. talking about Switch games. I'm too. just talking about Switch games. There's a, not a there's a, like not a lot of popular ones. Eh. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye.